I'm gonna slide back. I'm gonna slide forward. <laughs> Hello. What did I just do? I did the wrong thing. Welcome to the, what am I doing? Okay, I'm a little sleepy. Welcome. If you watch this in the replay, make sure you leave a comment, you leave a like, you open up the live chat so you can see what we're talking about because you never know what's gonna happen, especially on a day like today because I'm a little bit tired. But I am live from the chair. Oh, I shouldn't do that too much because I forgot that going around in circles fucks me up really badly. Hey, Diana. Hey. <laughs> I'm going to spin around and throw up. <laughs> that would not be good on camera. <laughs> Live because it's not like I could edit it. Live from the chair. That's right. My chair is fixed. The chair is put together. Hi, Savings Diva. Yes, I am in my chair and I have on clothes, just so we know. I, I had to go really high so y'all can see that. Right, giving us a twirl, baby. Two snaps and a twirl. <laughs> come on in, Lisa. You might as well come on in. Because <laughs> she tried not to laugh, laugh. And Lisa's here. Hi. Lisa's visiting. Yes, I am. Because she's going to the makeup show. For, cause yes. Because we're going to the makeup show tomorrow. Hey, Michelle. Hi, Ashley. Hi, Diana. So this is Lisa Springer for the people who have never seen her in real life. Hello. How does she feel? She's very... So, okay, you can tell this chair is made for men because it's got that lean back thing. <laughs> It's got the lean Hold back up. thing, but it's got the lower Sorry. lower back support. So that's good because I don't lean back. Why do men feel the need to lean back like they're extremely tall? Because they really aren't that tall. <laughs> you know, every man you know sits like this, like in cars and shit. You be like, you're not that tall, dude. Say, hey, Lisa. Hi. I said hi to Michelle. Actually, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I said hi. <laughs> I don't know. She's I'm, tired. She's I am tired, but I'm going live. And I washed some brushes. However, I have not washed all of my brushes. I mean, the brushes did you in. That was what made you tired. <laughs> yeah, they really did. And I, even, and I haven't even really got a good dent in the damn brushes. But I did wash bees because you know I'm her slave right now. Gotta I'm take her care slave. Mama. Baby mama. Tell sis hi. Hi, Sarah Elizabeth. How are you? Oh, I need to a little bit so it'll be nice and big right exactly that whole driving on the lean mm -hmm. looking like they're about to fall asleep and you know half of them can't see over the dashboard no. really well so it's like they just going on faith they are driving on faith that's the truth about it yep. men are stupid anyway true my mother wants this testosterone makes you stupid and she has three boys so it really, take word for it. it really does. I mean, they, they might be smart on some things, but some, the practical shit, no. no. Mm -hmm. They can be Einstein and go E equals MC squared and come up with theory of relativity, but going mm -hmm. up, but let the lights go out. Oh, she wanted to know <laughs> what's in the cup? It's a little cocktail. Mm -hmm. It's a little cocktail from last week at the gender reveal, so I had some left over. So I, and it was good the first time, so not. And, and sort of now it has been marinating for a week, so it's an extra strong. So the alcohol has gotten nice together. You know, they have like melded together in a beautiful mix. Oh, yeah, this is our second glass. <laughs> oh, it takes more than that to give me lids. Oh, okay. <laughs> she, she listen, hey, I got a lot to talk Remember, about. Remember, <laughs> she's she from Wisconsin back in the country. You know, them country folks, mm -hmm. they ain't got nothing better to do but to drink nope. sometimes. Mm -hmm. That's the truth. I mean, I know because I lived out there yes. and they was getting lit back in like eighth grade. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> see, <laughs> see, I know. By eighth grade, they was out there in the park. They'd be out there in the park. And when I, by mm -hmm. me, they would be out there in the park at, on Friday nights getting fucked up. Cornfields. 
Oh, see, you had the cornfields. Mm -hmm. I still got to come. I want to see drive Well, you wouldn't school. drink in the cornfields. You would drink by the cornfields. So when the cops would come, you could run into mm -hmm. the cornfield and then they couldn't catch you. That makes sense. Hi, so, Colette Cummings. You're new. Um, what's in it? It's a little something, something. You know, it was a little something. It was mm -hmm. just a little vodka wine thing. See the chair? Mm -hmm. You missed the spin. You you missed the two snaps in the twirl. Yeah. You, Lisa and we're not letting her do another twirl because she said she'd throw up if she did another <laughs> one. And I Hi, don't Anastasia. Want to come, so. Hi, Anastasia. I always say that name wrong. Anastasia, Anastasia. How do you say your name? Anastasia? Hey, because I know somebody, I have a friend whose daughter is named, same name, but it's Anastasia, and you better call her Anastasia, and she'll lose her damn mind. I have not decided about the name change. Oh, no, I'll never tell everything about my, this one I can kind of tell, because this isn't one I sell. So, I don't know what that, I, and honestly, let me just be real, I don't remember everything I put in it, <laughs> just being honest, sometimes it's like, whatever's here. There's like some peach or mango Station. kind of thing in it. Is it? I think so, because I that's what I taste. I don't know what else. Oh, well, that might be in there. <laughs> what the taste like is. I'm assuming. It must um, be something. I'm thinking. She said you get over there, you quiet. I'm, I'm gonna th I'm thinking. I think I put some pineapple juice on it. Yeah, it could be. No, I did do some kind of passion fruit, peach, something. It was yeah, something it was like that. Something. Yeah, it was some peach something with some Sprite. I know my alcohol. I'm from you Wisconsin. Always have, I know my alcohol. You always have to put some Sprite. When you make a punch, yes. learn this. Put Sprite in it. Sprite makes everything better. Not 7-Up. Not 7-Up and not ginger ale. It's nope. got to be Sprite. Sprite is the one. Yep. If you're making a big old batch of something... And I had two and a half gallons of it. I made two and a half gallons. <laughs> I'd be mad too. I'm like, I made all this. Why ain't y'all drinking? I'd be like getting kind of irritated with people. Like, oh, I'm not drinking that much. Why? Like know, Tara said, she's weeks, with family. So. <clears throat> You're supposed to be drinking. I just. That's why I wanted more today because I had some last week when I was here. I'm like, ooh, she's got some left. All right. Mm -hmm. It is tasty. I guess I could have one. If hey, I have Tammy. one, I'm going to be knocked. Hey Tammy, I'm gonna, have, I'm gonna be not at the fuck out. See, see, I like people like you, cause when I'm giving parties and I have like a big ass thing of punch, cause I have, I have been known to make a huge thing. Ooh, ceviche! I love She's ceviche, a fancy stuff. Uh, but mine can't have avocado in it. Yeah. Because I usually make mine in a bin. When I've done parties, I have a bin of punch. And I'll be like, y'all ain't going to drink it all? Kind of messes that. I'm like, all this teetotal is annoying to me. See? Is that where I'm from? I feel so, I feel so tall because I we, we let... Which, yeah, you're taller than me now. Right, I'm taller than... And that's not what's going to happen. <laughs> um, later on tomorrow. Okay, so... You should show me cute shoes you can wear. No, I showed them because remember I showed them that in my uh oh. favorites. No, my hot yeah, my favorites, my favorites. My favorites. I missed that. Oh, some Tito's. Okay, well let me just tell you something. Let me just tell you this. Bye, Shell. Is that when I make a punch, I don't use Tito's. And I'm gonna tell y'all why. Because you don't need the more expensive stuff if you're making a big ass punch. Ain't nobody gonna be able to tell the difference. You better go get you that cheap ass vodka and it knock them out just as good as Tito's. Mm -hmm. I like Tito's, don't get me wrong, but when it comes down to a punch, I get that cheap shit. Mm -hmm. Don't nobody know the difference. Listen, I did it, I've done the experiment for real. I had a bottle of Stoli, I finished it off, I bought a bottle of Dimitri put it in the Stoli bottle. Some people came over and they was like, you got some vodka? I was like, yeah, I got some vodka. And I pulled out that damn Stoli bottle. Cause I knew, cause you know how people, you know, I know people be like, oh, I know the difference. And I put that, I did that shit. And I gave it to them. It's like, see, that's what I'm talking about, Stoli. I was sitting there laughing. Yeah, I can not so much. Well, she, when you talk about sulfites, that's wine. Now, when we're talking about vodka, yes, you can. Most people can't tell the difference. 
Hi, hi, my this is this is my boo thing, Jim. Jim always oh, come in yeah, and call I've me. Seen Jim yeah, he always come in and call me beautiful. Hello. Yes. Um, now I cannot mess with that dark liquor, and I don't mess uh -huh. with gin because gin make you sin. <laughs> See, she didn't know that. Gin make you sin. I've never had gin. I have to say. Hi, Maria. Yes, because you said you've been watching me all day. So see, now you see me laugh. And I do have on clothes. Let's yes. just see. Let's just keep that. Yes, she does. There's something in cheap booze that messes with you. Okay, so I can see that. I'm going to give a look. Don't come around me, Amy. I'm going to give you some cheap booze. No, I'm just saying. Gin is nasty. I don't know why people, it's got juniper in it. It's terrible. One of my friends loves gin, and I'm just. I don't like the smell of gin. Gin stinks. Yeah, it smells like pine trees. Yes, it smells like pine trees. And I'm like, I'm not and drinking And I don't want to drink a pine no. tree. Hi, no. Lisa. Take two. Other Lisa. Lisa yes. This L1. And then I got I got like L2 infinity at this point. Because there's so many Lisas coming through. Yep. Vodka makes you spin. No, I'm just playing with you, Amy. Don't, don't worry. I, I'm not going to do you like that. I'm not going to. Uh, listen, I'm not going to do you. Like I do the people with the turkey bacon. <laughs> Hi, Alexandra. I'm not gonna do you like. Uh, I'm not gonna do you like the people I do with the uh, turkey bacon. Cause I cook it in bacon fat. <laughs> so it tastes like real bacon. <laughs> Makes the tastiest turkey bacon you'll ever have. Now let me just say. Let me just say this for the people who gonna get all of their feelings. If I have turkey bacon for me, I do it with bacon fat. I just mess with the turkey bacon people. They be like, oh my God, that's terrible. You're gonna make me sick. Calm down, I won't do it for you. But if I have some turkey bacon, it's gonna be cooked in bacon fat. Just gotta pat it off a little. That's right, right, exactly. Right? Okay, let me get some of that because this is kind of. I'm look, watching her drink and I'm like, okay, excuse me, you got to get off my drink. Don't want to hold up the chair. Woo! You throw up, I'm not cleaning it up. I'm <laughs> you right now. <laughs> and she's found out it does not have brakes on it, so if she starts rolling, she's going to roll. Luckily, my floors are kind of straight because that could be very problematic if I had a lead in the floor. All of a sudden, you see your feet flying in the air. You know why? What? Oh, that one's done. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna say. I'm like, you're the one that told me where it was. I have another one. I was just trying to see. Oh, that's good. Yeah. I have another full bottle of it. I'm a recycler. You know, you gotta recycle these bottles. Fill them with other stuff. Why not? It works. Yes, and she even let me have the Harry Potter glass. So I feel very special. Well, I mean, come on now. Oh, there's Juicy. <laughs> huh? Juicy is by the window. What is she in the window? What is she showing? Let me in. Let me in. It's raining. Oh, oh look my God. God. On the third floor. Cat, <laughs> you about to die out here. <laughs> It's been raining and the cat didn't want to come in, but now she's out by the windows oh, no, no. screaming at Lou going by in the house. Here she is. She don't go eat. She's pissed now. She's like, you left me out there. I did not leave her little crazy ass out there. I told her not to go out there. <laughs> in the rain. <laughs> Poor Juicy nothing. Juicy wanted to be out there. She did. Bianca tried to get her in before and she wouldn't come in, so. We don't we don't have Tipsy Lulu yet. It could happen though. <laughs> Cause I honestly have not been drinking that much. No, she <laughs> hasn't. What the rolling? Well, cause I put it as high as it could go, so I wouldn't look nude. And did he say, look at all? Where did you come from? Where did you say my, wait a minute. 
Man, shut up. <laughs> Let me get my bottle. Oh, snap. Oh, okay. <laughs> My feet can barely touch the floor. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Gonna have to tie a rope on there to the table so we don't lose it. Right, right. <laughs> Anchor you down. So right, right. Yeah. <laughs> and right. I got it up high, so because yeah. can't you, you know I have it up high because you see how tall yeah. you see how short Lisa looks to me. And I'm like, what? What's that? How tall are you? Five, five one. Two, yeah, five I'm, two, five three. I'm five eight. <laughs> so yeah, not even close. <laughs> and I'm looking us. I'm, I'm looking. I'm us. statuesque. You are to you. <laughs> you are statuesque. It's like where is so and so? And I have to go like this, and then go. Oh, go over there. <laughs> right. See, usually I'm just like looking around. It's like oh, that's right. You're tall. You can look. <laughs> Who is this Robert Sharky? Okay, I'm gonna leave you alone, uh, dude. Cause you done lost your mind. Okay. <laughs> what did he say? What did he say? Ashley, I didn't even Ashley was on it. That, it so on quick, it. I didn't see what he said. I kind of figured he was heading that direction. But right when he said I had the big booty. Yeah. And yes, I do. And Bella's not here, so Ashley actually had a chance to. He said he's my. Oh, out. okay. See. Oh yeah, no. Good job. <laughs> I could talk all kind of stuff about that, but okay, mm -hmm. I'll leave it alone because you know I know about the peoples too. Mm-hmm. And I'm starting to get tipsy. No rabbit holes. No rabbit holes. So we got a bunch of people in here who's no, not normally in here. So we need to talk. What were we talking about earlier? I Nothing. I was no, 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 no. I'm on here. No, not on here. Oh. I'm talking about you and I. Oh, we God. really weren't talking about anything other. There's really nothing going on. You know, cause like we've got that <laughs> ugly. <laughs> I could mess. We with know you me. got it, Ashley. We know you. Hey, Candace. Exactly. You know what kids are for, and long handled spoons are for. I can do a long handle spoon and just do it. Oh, so let's talk about my latest trend that I was talking about. So I can make some people angry at me. <laughs> I'm, telling you, happens, right? I'm telling you, I'm not going to be welcomed in the YouTube community because of you people. Because y'all be like, tell the names you see. So the latest trend is, are y'all ready? It's a, it's a spinoff. From the declutter, whiny, angsty, I'm the, I'm overwhelmed by my makeup. This is a spinoff. The new spinoff is, I don't know if I'm going to be on YouTube anymore. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. You know, um, it's just not the same. I'm not loving my makeup like that. Uh -huh. I just don't know anymore. And I think I'm going to cut back. Been waiting for the stands to go. No, don't leave. Right? It's you know what it is. It's the Facebook exit s speech. Mm -hmm. So that everybody will see, be able to stay there. Please don't, don't leave, leave us. We will never be the same. We will never be the same. You know because YouTube well, is not do. nice anymore, and we're not we're not gaining people like we used to. So that's the new whiny, angsty vibe that's going on right now. That's the new trend. So that means that if right, you but hey, Melissa, try to pull that. We have the right to go knock it off. <laughs> if I off. ever do <laughs> that, y'all better be going, bitch. What's wrong with you? Don't say shut, shut up. <laughs> right. Mm-hmm. Be like, I can't with you anymore. Just right. <laughs> see, you know what? Oh, see what? See, Amy went right there for us, kid. I didn't even have to say Ash. I didn't even have to say it. Angelica has one. Oh, Samantha, Samantha March has one. So they're all upset. Now, let me tell you why they're upset. Let me just break down why they're upset. A, they're not gaining. Their, their um, growth is slowed down. And they're not getting as many views. That's all. 
So they may have. But wasn't Angelica just starting to get PR and stuff? Right. So we're right. going to be sad because we finally made it enough to get to PR that we're going to quit. Well, no, no. See, here what that's supposed to be. Uh. <laughs> you said he was very happy to hear the good news. I love her. <laughs> Here's what she's doing. Don't just let like, the door hit you. <laughs> just like she did with the no buy and then she started getting a lot of PR. This is supposed to ignite people to mm-hmm. watch her more and make sure her views go up because mm-hmm. if they don't want her to leave, then they're then they'll watch her more. Now, let me just tell y'all what I need y'all to do for me. And if you have I need to start doing it myself though. Right, exactly. Exactly. Angelica Nyquist. She's Swedish. So here's the thing. The thing the way it works is that's nice if you like to do them and that's wonderful. But if you're trying to get paid, if you're trying to get views, you gotta go with what people want to see. So you can't I got listen. Right? <laughs> Honey, they need to go get a glass of wine. The whiny bitches need to go get, drink some wine. That's what they need to do. Right, I did bully her earlier this summer. Well, Kelly didn't silence you. Wait a minute, wait a minute. He said you cannot silence me, Robert. I love you though. Keep giving me that engagement. Kick him out so he can come back in and make me some more money. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Kelly didn't kick you out, but Ashley will. (laughs) Right, right. There you go. (laughs) Get the name. Let's get him out (laughs) so that he can then, you know, come back in and give me another view. Okay, see, so, poor, poor Ashley's on the moderator duty by, duty by herself. Right, today. she is. I Michelle's see. gone. gone. Bella's not, not here. here. I yeah, where the hell's Bella? Hi, Sharon. He said, Ashley, you better put the call out to Bella and tell her she can get her, right. get her she said, in. What? But yeah, so that's the newest thing. And this is my thing is that, but I'm telling you, that's, to, that's her way, a catalyst for her it, because this has worked with the PR. I think she thinks that's going to work. You know, ooh, did she go there? All right, Miss Kelly. Hey, high five on that with a massive yes. bag of Yeah. Kelly, you thought you were the pee. one that put him at a timeout, so, I think. Oh well. Yeah, He'll so get over it. <laughs> right. So we have um, so now so now we will see a trend of people talking about that. You know, so we're gonna see the trend of people and what's gonna happen is smaller YouTubers than them are going to follow that trend because they think that this is a cool trend to be on. Right? And that's what's going to happen. So watch. This is a new trend. I don't love it. And I don't know what I'm going to do. And I need to make... Because what actually, who started it was Georgia Harris. Mm-hmm. Yeah, because she was... Right, because, you know, she gave up her channel and she's now doing other things. Mm-hmm. But then she came back and was like, my makeup is different. And I like it. It was like, didn't nobody get it? Yeah. Well, nobody, didn't nobody know about your damn makeup, Georgia. And I like Georgia, but it's like... And you could have stayed put and different makeup what right clearly you want to be on here i forgot to put me on do not disturb sorry we're too busy in my sorry. chair we forgot sorry. About sorry. About sorry. About do not disturb sorry um he's gonna be like did she just have to put me on he gonna call me again damn leave me alone <laughs> is that one of the dates that's the one who um is that the electrician Yep. Okay. Yep, 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 yep. So, yeah, he, he ain't spent no money. He, mm-hmm. Don't tell him about your money. Right, right, right. Guards right. do anything. Yes. But it's like, 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 with, here's my thing with Georgia Harris. Georgia, you're saying that this was such a terrible place for you. It brought out the worst in you, and yet you've come back. Right. So, so either, so, okay, no, you're not making, buying makeup, supposedly. Oh, yeah, I watched hers. I watched Samantha's about cutting back on YouTube because she's feeling like she's losing. She's not getting subscribers. She's losing subscribers and people aren't watching. And here's what she said. Now, here's what she said. And this was interesting. And I I, I did comment. I doubt if she'll respond to me. But it was a good comment. She was talking about like looking at the YouTube and how she got she got on YouTube and wasn't signed in and saw in the um hey bella hey bella about time you got in here she's still in the car <laughs> i have to catch the trolls for so she said yes. that looking at it like there's more stuff like um 
you know, more celebrities are on here putting their own channels up, more corporations like Vogue and everything is putting up, um, you know, their own stuff. So, um, oh no. Oh, I hope, I hope he's all right. God, this sounds terrible. Yeah. Um, and so I said, um, so, <laughs> so yeah, between Kelly and Ashley, we, we had a handle. Right. So she was like, um, so what she said was that, you know, with all that happening, how can smaller YouTubers stay on and grow, you know, because YouTube is going to push out people like, you know, the big YouTubers, um, the big YouTubers and like any celebrities. Cause like she was saying like Kylie has a, you know, like JLo has a, you know, page and all this others, you know, it's channel. So I said, and then, oh, the other thing that, you know, apparently some YouTubers are upset about is because the verification where you had a verified channel, they've taken that away, um, you know, for at, at a certain level, you have to be a really large YouTuber mm -hmm. to have a verified channel. So they're all up in arms in that. Now, my thing is this, does that matter? No. Does that mean, does that um, matter if your channel is verified and people are watching it. I mean, the, the little shit that you're upset yeah. about, what the fuck is that? Is that that beat? Probably. I saw it before. Oh, okay. So I think it's okay. I don't think it was a warning. If it is, I'll kill it. For you okay. Hi, Linda. Right. But here's the thing. Now, yes, we're going to see a lot more. Hey, Joshua. Hi, Joshua. We're going to see a lot more celebrities. Celebrities are getting on board with it. And you know why? Because they found out how much people were making on YouTube. Right. So now they're like, shit, let me get some of that pie. And they will, you know. Oh, yeah. I mean, they have an automatic audience already. Built right. Up They've got their audience. So so what? So that's not going to keep people who watch me or somebody no. like small. And why? Because y'all they're watching because they want to see people like us so to say that because celebrities are coming on here it's going to keep people from watching you that's stupid right. that's just an excuse or a reason but let me say this get all the reasons you want get off youtube cut back stop doing it because then you leave the space open for me exactly. so what's going to happen is and then oh and then she was saying i didn't know this this youtube has creator managers YouTube has creator managers okay. that will help creators and give them, you know, help and really like help them with their channel. Samantha March had one at one point. And doesn't anymore? They stopped it. She doesn't have enough. She So now she doesn't have enough so she, subscribers to so get she it. she has to come up with it on her own. And right. She so, doesn't know what to do. Right. So the, that particular manager, like she said, that manager helped her decide on, was like, hey, you should make Will I Buy It? into a series so they would help like and look at your analytics mm -hmm. you know suggest things to do for your channel so as a larger youtuber you get that mm -hmm. so now she doesn't have it she's like and they just stopped it on me and it, it, it she, and but apparently she's done it long enough that she should kind of have an idea of how to do that on her own oh she right yeah, but you I mean, know, no, but like, I mean, yeah, you're gonna have the help and stuff like that, but you should no, but like now, like her saying, like, oh, my views are down, they would kind of look through it and say, and they suggest it, and they, and because they work for YouTube, they can make really good suggestions, right? Because they're gonna have info that you can, right? Exactly. Get. So, apparently, sense. larger YouTubers have access to this, and for a while, smaller ones, like you know, like around 20 or 30,000 could get them, right. and so which the bigger ones don't need it the smaller ones do, do but, you but know, yeah but yeah. Who, but who are they gonna help but, yeah the they're gonna help them make fill their fill yeah their they're gonna help the money makers and so that's what i told i said i said well you know youtube is a business and it is evolving and yes i am filling my glass again because i'm not driving anywhere tonight i'm staying here <laughs> and like i said before i'm from wisconsin i can handle a lot of right <laughs> right 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 those right they would help edit they would do a lot yeah, for you that makes so sense. you know by losing that yeah. it, so i think yeah a and lot of them yeah she'd have to pay for an editor and all that other stuff right that, and so i think that them. helped a lot of these smaller creators that have grown really quickly that might have also helped them also mm -hmm. and now they don't have that so that was taken away from them now the whole verification thing i don't understand what's the big deal who cares yeah. people are going to watch you Oh, yes, okay. it was provided for free, Melissa. The yes. verification thing that, I mean, 
mean, that's Twitter and Instagram and all those. They're all right. So wrapped up about getting the little check. Check. Right. Yeah. It's, it's like, like so. What, what does it matter if they're following you? They're following you. Especially on YouTube, you know, yeah. people like IG. I get it because people try to do iterations of your name so that right. they can pull right. away from right. you, so that they can know that this, this is, is the, the actual person. person. And yes, for somebody who's a large person, you ain't large enough to get that shit. No, I mean, right? right. Nobody but them. Mm -hmm. But like, I understand now why that was a you know. Now I'm getting it because probably a lot of these people were using those creator managers mm -hmm. and we're getting a lot yeah, of assistance and I didn't get none of that shit you know we, so we don't get that at this level I think now um I'll be your manager they will tell you what you need to do right right exactly I mean could y'all be my editors my, my creator managers let's mm -hmm. let's make that happen so it's like so it, but but what it says is now it's a little harder because let's be honest all of them were growing really fast for a while you know they had really good growth they were had really good views and now your views are slowing down your growth is slowed down so now you got to rethink some things and you got to do something if you're going to make it so instead of trying to deal with it they're like i'm just going to cut back i'm just going to cut back if you're already losing views that's going to impact your views again right and it may make people right. unsub why wouldn't you just try to go with what you got already and keep it going? Right. Right. Mm -hmm. Right. Exactly. You got free HBO for a little bit because they forgot you just enjoy it. And then yep. you have to now figure out how you're going to get HBO. Because none of them are like, oh, gee, now I only get like. 20 bucks a month from AdSense, they're still getting crazy amounts of money. I mean, they're getting decent money because they do enough that it's going to be worth them putting in their time. Right. But I also think, and that's what we were saying in that little chat, is you know, that I think they also think that, that they're supposed to be at this <laughs> level where they should be getting PR, where they shouldn't have to pay for things. You know, so it's like, come on now. Mm -hmm. So guess what? Go on and cut back. I'm yeah. still here. I'm still here, but, and also, um, also, I think they also need to say, okay, what I've been doing, guess what you've been doing? Like, for instance, her, will I buy a series? She's been doing that damn thing for two years now. People are getting bored with them because everybody's been doing them. Everybody does anti-hauls. It's like, you know, okay, so now you might need to move into something different. You might need to be trying something different as opposed to the stuff that's been working for you. That's why all these people are so upset about tutorials. Nobody watches them. So now they're all upset because the people who got so many views off of tutorials, nobody's watching them. Well, now you better figure out something else to do. And if not, get off and make some space for me. And the thing is, they've got enough subscribers that they could ask them, okay, what kind of content are you looking for? What would you like me to do? It? Are you guys getting bored with this? Or do you guys still really want me to do it? Then right. I'll continue it. Right. But if, you want to see something else, give me some ideas of what you want me to do. Right. It's not that difficult. It's not rocket science for some of this stuff. I mean, right. Especially and, for them with that half. Right. Thing. But here's my other thing. This whole thing, like, I'm losing my love for makeup. I'm losing my, my, my love for makeup. And <laughs> can you yeah. see it? Really? Just because you're, <laughs> then you never really right. loved it to begin with. It, it was just for your channel because if you love makeup, I mean, I've loved makeup since I was a kid and I'm always going to love makeup and it's not going to be right. And let know. me tell you something. If you notice something like I yes. have one of the most active community tabs, you mm -hmm. know, I, hi Maria, you know, I do have a very active community tab and it's not just about me talking about my channel. And I think one of the things that none of them understand is that you have to integrate things more now. You can't just be one dimensional. I know that this whole thing has always been, you know, we have this one dimensional thing. Uh, oh yeah, th yeah, they're manipulation. Most definitely, Sarah. You know, it's that's the thing is like, you know, all they all you'll ever see most people put on the community tab is, hey, I'm doing a video. This video is coming up. Or something like that so that's why I kind of don't use mine like that I'll put up every once in a while but I really do put up more 
thoughts I have, stuff yeah. I see, stuff like that, mainly because I think the community tab should be an extension and not just just you know me me using it as an advertising tool. Mm-hmm. And the thing is with all entertainment, it's gonna change and you have to be ready for that change. Right. You can't just right think that okay, what I've done since day one and ten years ago is gonna be the same thing that people are gonna like ten years from now because right. things have changed drastically in that time and if you don't move forward and come up with something right. else, yeah, you are gonna ten die. Years Your from, will die. Ten years we ago we weren't we weren't contouring, we weren't highlighting like we do. We, you know, no, we not, were talking about that with the like back in high school, the stuff, right? Like right. not using makeup brushes and right, you know, and nobody thought that contour. Nobody ever heard of contour. Please, we can not contour or highlight or anything. It was like if you had blush and eyeshadow and mascara on, you were good. You right, used the eyeliner. Exactly. That's why certain artists stay mm-hmm. relevant where others die because they try to continue to do the same exact thing they've done and it dies you know yeah. one person like for instance let's just be real now not not so much now but madge madonna was a master at reinvention you know and that's why she has such a long career because she changed and evolved all the time i told my tell my kids this all the time they always you know this person is the great singer of the time i'm like yeah you know what they're not going to be here in a year because they can't write their own music right they have to rely on somebody else to tell them here you can sing this for us right and i'm like they're never going to make it right if they can come up with something new right all the time for themselves then they're going right. to stick around right I mean, right exactly i mean like for instance beyonce if we can take beyonce beyonce yeah. started out with destiny's child bubblegum music now she's more relevant her music has more depth to it her, you know she's done she's evolved with time right. because she couldn't stay where she was mm-hmm. you know <laughs> especially with yeah, something I mean, right right exactly. see that's what i'm saying mm-hmm. Bella, give me that because yes. i don't think beyonce can sing either mm-hmm. i don't think she can sing that well mm-hmm. either but but she's got all the back and, and madonna can, and, yeah. yeah and madonna can't sing that well no. either no, but she really. but she evolved Oh, Madge is fun to watch. She changed right. up. You know, she has become more over the years. But she's had some bombs too, where she, because she thought, yes, that, she hey, did. everybody's going to just love me because I'm Madonna. And it's like, no, that's not. Now that she's gotten days. older, it's like, Madonna, mmm, Because mm. yeah. some of that stuff she was doing, hi, Amy, mm-hmm. was not good. No. It was not good. Her later oh, stuff. God, when she did the American Pie remake. Oh, yes, oh, yes. That was just mad. Yes. Yes. Um, but yeah, that's why right. we have like a Billy Joel or an right. John and those people still around because they can write their own shit and they keep coming up with something but, different and know that they can but, do it. But here's the thing. Okay, Queen Bay, uh, okay, I'm not going to go down there, but I think she's much better now. Oh, I yeah. like her now. I like her as a performer mm-hmm. much better. Right, she's uncomfortable. I know you were talking about Madge. I got you, but mm-hmm. Bay is the same thing for me, child. Yeah. Okay, but let me say this. Uh, yes, yes. <laughs> you say, yes, I remember yeah. when they had to do that for her. Because, yeah, when she was a beat That was Which I don't that understand was, why they ever did that. I, I don't it either. Just don't cry. It was don't cry for me, Argentina. We all cried for Argentina mm-hmm. at that moment. We was all crying yeah. for Argentina when she was a beta. We were like, yeah, it, that kind of stuff irritates me because I'm a big music person. And like when I went to see Queen with Adam Lambert, right? he learned all the songs in the key that Freddie sang it because he's like, that's what people want to hear. Right. I can't do it. Right. That's what I, I shouldn't. I mean, let's be honest, you need to do. even though it is a classic now, mm-hmm. when The Wiz came out, oh. Everybody was like, Diana Ross is Dorothy? Right, because it was just like, no, she's too old and everything else. Right, you know? Oh. Now, we love the movie, but it's not because of Diana. It's because of Michael. Let's just be honest. Oh, yeah. yeah. But during the time, I, I remember when The Wiz was coming out. Everybody everybody, everybody mm-hmm. felt like they should have gave it to Stephanie Mills, but yeah. they gave it to Diana she because she was a bigger name. Mm-hmm. She killed it, but not like Stephanie. Right. She sang the music. Well, I mean, she sang the music perfectly, but 
if you have see because you um to, but, okay but so see, much that they change they change the story so much so that they could fit her okay but can i say story. this kelly you say the wiz is your jam because you never were able to see stephanie mills on on stage yes, do it she was i saw her do it she was she toured with it and stephanie was bad as hell and diana has never had her range so they had to bring that music down for her because she cannot she ain't got stephanie's range and if you want to find out about Stephanie's range today, because I've seen, I will have to find it because she was here for the Chosen Few picnic a couple of years ago and the music went off. They, the music went off. Yes, yeah, she did, of course. Um, and she sang a cappella. And Stephanie got a voice on her to this day. Well, she got it because of Barry Gordy and because she said she could get Michael. That was the big thing. Well, she yeah, she said, got it because I can get Michael right. Jackson to be in your movie. And they were right. like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, you know, it would have been stupid not to. And this, she can sing. Fine. Was, I mean, she's a performer. Yeah. Diana is a performer. Because I'm going to tell you what. My favorite oh, yeah. Super Bowl performance is Diana Ross. Yeah, and if you have so never cool. seen Diana Ross's... Super Bowl performance. You the need helicopter. to <laughs> Yes, the helicopter. <laughs> oh if you like, have never seen him, okay, she that just is was like is the best. Yep. Cause only Miss Diana can do about five mm -hmm. costume changes and leave in a helicopter. Yep. And it's if true. you see, they don't show the whole thing because what they said at the end. Did you see the very end of it where where, the, where they flash across the screen? A, a, a lady knows how to enter a room, but a diva knows how to leave. <laughs> You've never seen. I'm gonna have to find it for you. Oh, let me see. Where's it? It's gotta be on YouTube. Hold up. Yeah, it is. Hold up. Yeah, no, she is just. Oh, yeah, that was some of those. Or even like. <laughs> did you ever? Did you see it when she did the concert in Central Park? Yes. And there's a freaking thunderstorm, and she's out there singing, and her dress and everything is blowing in the wind, and it's. <laughs> Pouring rain, and she's just out there. And, and Diana <laughs> sang through it all. Yeah, like, I mean, she is an entertainer. Now. Did you yeah. see that? Did you see the? Uh, huh? <laughs> yeah, I'm kind of scared. One of these times, she's gonna roll over here. <laughs> I'm gonna have to catch her because she's just flying. <laughs> Between her and Aretha Franklin, those are the two. Even though I will say, performers to no end. I, okay, so I've like, seen Aretha went back in the '80s. I saw Aretha; she was okay. Stephanie Mills gave, gave a better show. What the hell? No. Although, did you ever see it when she did the Kennedy Centers for? Um, um, oh, hold on, let me get this up for y'all. The one that wrote um, the. Um, she said, "No, someone is. In I'm not going to be injured. <laughs> Fine." Um, she did a Kennedy Center's honors for. Um, Oh God, I can't think of her name. Why can't I think of her name? The net, the one that wrote Natural Woman. I can't think of her name, but they. She came out, and that was like a few months before she passed away from cancer, and she came out in a fur coat, sat down at the piano, and sang it like Carol King. Thank you very much. Carol. Thank you, because I couldn't get it. <laughs> I'm, I'm like, like, I can see your freaking face. What is her name? <laughs> I, I can hear it. She came out and did that, and did it at the piano, and was only a few months away from passing away and it was just I mean I remember the Obamas were sitting there and they were crying because it was just amazing so was Carol King and everybody else because it was just okay amazing. so here I go we found it yeah, and now here's Trent South welcome to Ask My Halftime Show Oh, and the Carol King one? Big Name City Productions and the National Football League proudly celebrate the 30th anniversary of the Super Bowl. Starring the legendary performer who has entertained millions of people around the world. Oh, I've never seen Beth Miller, and I would love to see Beth oh, Miller. Go. Oh, my I would, God. I would have loved to see him while she was still touring. Mm -hmm. I just didn't have a lot of fun. crazy. Stuff which came out with the mermaid costume. Can you all see it? Because I know it's kind of bright in here. I 
got to stop it because, you know, I will get dinged if I do not stop it every once in a while because, you know, that's how YouTube works, bitches. Oh, I bet, Bella. I would love to have seen Natalie Cole. She could... Her I actually, I actually things. saw Natalie Cole because um, back years ago when I was a kid because she was married to a guy from Chicago named Marvin Yancey who actually was the one who got her caught up on drugs. Um, um, this was 1996. Ross's wind machine no her oh, no kidding. she has oh, her, perfect her wind machine has always been perfection mm -hmm. always been perfection that baby keeps it never comes into her face it always you was at the concert of, see Maria okay it always just Where comes, poured rain and they were <laughs> you know she it always comes off of her face yeah. it never I need that one I will say the amount there's a lot of singers that she doesn't like. Diana Ross, she actually likes. You know, Diana's like, yeah, let's see. That must be it. She likes the Motown stuff, though, it's funny. Costumes change in a second. Because Stevie is her man, actually. Megan's. <sighs> you know, I saw songs. I, you Drama know, I, Queen loves Stevie. Megan. You know, I saw the songs in the Kia Life concert, oh, and that gosh. she would. That. Her head would explode. Concert. No, she wouldn't explode like my bed. Because that is my favorite album of all oh, time. Oh, she loves that one too. And I remember when it first came out, and I loved that song, that album, since I was nine years old. Oh, doesn't that. Like Queen, but. I'm like, all right, finally, she likes Stevie and Aretha. Oh, that out, that, that yeah. concert was freaking oh, awesome. Oh, I can imagine that. Stevie's happen. a great entertainer, though. Oh, he, yeah. He's really funny. He doesn't take himself seriously. And when he's saying, mm -hmm. isn't she lovely, to his mm -hmm. daughter, oh, because she's his, ba she's his backup singer. So Aisha... The one that he wrote it about? Yeah, so she's his backup singer. So he sings it to That's her. Awesome. And I was in tears. <laughs> oh, yeah, I would have been a basket case. I will never not understand her love. make these stops so that YouTube doesn't ding you. Unless, of course, hold up, let me just say this. Unless, of course, you're Shane Dawson and oh, Jeffree yes. Star because I got dinged for them, even though we were watching that. Yes, yes, when they love about oh. the VMAs, yes. It's like, you know Stevie can't walk by himself. <laughs> you do know he needs somebody. Just <laughs> right. hang out by the piano for the rest of the night. <laughs> Yeah, so if, yeah, because he had that music so loud, I got ding for copyright. I didn't get a ding, but I can't monetize it. So I'm letting people watch it because I'm not making any money off of it. But I'm okay with that because views will bring people to watch something else. Sometimes, unless they hate me. Come on, Diana. Let's let's start changing them clothes. 
Right, exactly. I was just giving me a little couple of dollars. Listen, Shane got us watching this bullshit so he can make his money. It was too close. No, okay, let me see. Why do there we go. Thank you, Diana. I think that was more than that, bad they were for the environment uh, aren't weren't they bad for the environment nowadays they'd be like oh you see all those balloons and which is bad you know the, the environment does need it does not need the poor birds don't need it right i remember they did that because i remember it was on tv that night it's on hbo right and she was like i'm gonna keep saying you're like no watches it people watch the super bowl for the commercials and the halftime show unless their football team is in it right and i mean most of the time it ain't okay yeah chicago's been kind of relaxed yeah we had that one time and then you know was it 1985 we about to That's why they're so pulled back far away from her right now. You notice they're not really showing her right now. She changed her clothes. Because we done done the whole song and ain't nobody seen Diana. Right? Diana Ross says Super Bowl um, because you have to see the end. Girl, that contour was screaming to uh, that contour is screaming from 1996 to now. That's how deep it is. That's why the drag queens love her so much. They're going, damn, look at that. Call Miss Patty. They love them some Miss Patty. Right, 
okay, we're gonna give her a second because you know I gotta keep stopping it because you know YouTube be playing with your ass. But fair use, I see 31 people. I need to see some more fucking likes and more people talking too. Yeah, and I need some more people talking. There's 30 people in here right now. Look, that 31 was like she gonna tell us to talk now, mm -hmm. and we it's 31 people. I need to see a hello. Hello, I'm drinking. I'm twirling in a. I cannot twirl now that I'm I've been drinking. Hi, since I'm here for once and. seeing this when hey Diana um when she broke up with the Supremes and it was so sad did you not no see so you're a little bit younger than me a little bit younger but right still, I, I remember when oh yeah yeah that's what she did but I remember when she did it on and they sang together that was their last time singing and it was so sad <laughs> are sad we never said that auntie what miss D miss diana was a was a songstress no. now she's an entertainer that's like saying janet can sing fight me on that one because janet jackson cannot sing no the only reason diana was in front is because of mary gordy <laughs> well yeah we know that's why because mary mary wilson had a better voice than her much better <laughs> She had the look that worked, you know. She rocked them wigs, child. She rocked them '60s wigs. Mm -hmm. them wigs was killing it. Yeah, killing it. Them wigs, the the 1960s wigs don't get too close to them because they might melt if you it was too hot. Don't get them close to a fire. Ah, no, don't. Right, she was a glamorous mm -hmm. one. Yeah. And it, okay, but let's be honest. Oh, Janet can dance. Oh yeah. Now there's no doubt Janet can't. Yeah, she was glamorous, but it also helped that she was fucking the, the president of the company. Okay. Okay. Plus okay. she was a little light skin too, so that No, she ain't. No, she ain't. No, no, she ain't. no, Janet. No. Not Janet. No, Diana's brown. Okay, let me do it. She Let me do this. Let me do the yeah, that's her whisper voice. Anytime, any place, I don't care who's around. <laughs> Janet Hook had some help from some autos. <laughs> she got help and she got Jimmy Jam and Terry Lewis. So she, that first album was terrible. Okay, that's true. She is she 
is lighter than Mary. You know, back in the day. I'm just saying. Hi. I'm just saying. Anytime. Any place. Now, don't talk get me wrong, because let me just say this. For real, for real, for real. Rhythm Nation is one of my favorite oh, yeah. videos ever. Rhythm Nation was dance. hot. She can dance. But you know what else I like? is? Did you see the, uh, on, what's the show with, uh, Chrissy Teigen and LL Cool J. Oh, the rap battle or not lip sync battle? Lip sync battle. Did you see when jo Joseph Gordon Hewitt did Rhythm Nation? Mm -mm. Did you ever see the kid from Spider Man that did uh, Rihanna? Yes, when he did. That was oh, movie. that was. <laughs> <a movie. laughs> now Joseph Gordon Hewitt. Yeah, he I've seen him. Killed, he killed. He killed Rhythm he, Nation. Yeah. Oh, it was like watching Janet. Mm -hmm. He did it so good. Yeah, he knows how to dance and sing. Right. I mean. Play Even I though like, he didn't sing I like, that one, he I like Pleasure Principle too. Yeah. yeah, but he did good with the rain because he hit that. Yeah. Yeah, between him and Tom Holland, those are my two favorite ones when he did Rihanna and I was like, holy. <laughs> right. All right. Hey, see you, Amy. If you got the word, just sing along with me. Okay, we're going to pull that up too, Amy. Oh, this is the thing on here. It's really light. Jackets that will flow, flow with, with the, the wind. wind. <laughs> the wind. <laughs> Do you see? Yes. Do you see that? She has professional wind machines. She, she, that wind and machine like, is ain't nobody got a wind machine no. like her. No. Oh yeah. Okay, it was 1996. She had to have a cat suit on. <laughs> yeah, 1996. So it's not a good one. It was cat. She's purple and orange in it up. Yeah, so many of them. Don't you always hate when people do that? Don't you don't you hate when when you see people like this do other people's songs and you're like, but you have a great catalog. Right. Why are you hey, doing this? She's got more than most. You know what I'm saying? It's like yeah. she could have done the boss right there, which is yeah. one of my favorite songs. I mean, not that no one gets the prize and the boss together. But okay, she didn't get to do that. Mm -hmm. Oh, I love black cat. Wait a minute, she does it as well. Wait a minute, can I say this? This sounds like the Vegas rendition. It does. It's oh, nice I, I will survive. You oh I was my just God. thinking that. I'm like, I oh, will survive. No, honey. This sounds like a Vegas stage show. I'm like, no, you can't do it. Quite Diana, no, stop it. This is but not anyone. <laughs> this is Stick to your own. Stick to your own. <laughs> This hoe does it up. Okay, mm -hmm. gotta give it a minute. Cause yeah. the hoe is about to take us out. She's about to take us out now. Yes, a helicopter. Uh-huh. Okay, but you 
can't fuck with this hoe. You can't fuck with Diana. A helicopter, y'all. A helicopter. Ain't been done since. The, the only one it? that was close, I think, was Lady Gaga when they showed her jumping off the thing and then she came flying down in the middle of it. That was she close, did that. With that that, that was kind of like what Je- what Michael did when he did his though. Because yeah. Michael did his like that. But those are not the only ones that are. Because Michael had a great show too. Oh, but yeah. I mean, Michael Jackson was on that. She's like, wait a minute. You know, in that moment, she was like, where's my wind machine? This yes. is off. Yes. You need to blow my hair in my, out of here. Get my hair together. And where are the things I have to hold on to? Because I'm not falling out. Yes, it does sound like something like a. But the end, it was like, the helicopter was, yeah. but the song was like, why are you doing this? The helicopter scene. Yeah. <laughs> okay, look, look, look. Yeah. A true diva knows how to make a grand entrance and an even grander exit. That's my shit right there. <laughs> That's <laughs> my shit right there. <laughs> that is yeah. my shit right there. All of that was yeah. for the helicopter. And so she didn't say that. Yeah. Oh, it didn't matter mean, what song she sang, it wouldn't have mattered. A true diva knows how to make a grand entrance and an even grander exit. If that is not fucking yeah. late. She could have sang Old McDonald's and she it would have been great at the end. It would have been like, dang. Yep. Yeah. No, you can't. You, you can't, can't, you can't fuck you can't fuck with that. And and, and when they put this up. I don't know, but it was some good stuff, Bella, because that's <laughs> Okay, well, Coco, for real, Diana wore wigs for years. Right, I mean, you, yeah. can't, you can't fuck with that, with the damn... No, no, I mean, she could, the whole thing could have sucked. It wouldn't have, but it... And we didn't even like the last time. I'm like, damn, look at that, yeah. Back then, she was wearing a wig, a wig honey. Oh, yeah, Coco, those, she wore wigs, Those honey. 90s wigs would have caught for her, too, yeah, you're right. No, she wore, Diana is known for wigs, love. Yeah. Trust me. Yeah, she probably had to braid it in and glue it Yeah, yeah, that's a wig. Then. She's been, <laughs> she's always worn wigs, Coco. She's been known for wigs since the 60s. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yes, baby, that's a wig. Diana always wore wigs. Right, yeah, she could have done a Motown song, that, a song at the end that would have, or like I said, it ain't no mountain high enough. She could have done that one at the end. Yeah, like yeah. The helicopter would have worked. I don't know why she picked that one. What that am was, I looking for? Kind of strange. Yeah, Michael, where's that? No, one? we're gonna oh. do. We're gonna do lip sync battle. Oh, the lip sync battle with um, Joseph Gordon Levitt. Yes, my birthday twin, by the way. Oh, is he? He is. Yeah, she's more wigs forever. Back, yeah. Yeah, between him and the no, you want the. There we go. Right there. Right there. What? Right there. Do we? Isn't that no, no, that's the beginning uh, part of it. That's the news. Yeah. Hold on. Let me see. Um, okay. I'm going here. <coughs> Ooh, excuse me. Um, that's the recap. Um, let's see. I'm trying to find it. Right. They did. Right. Oh yeah, she been wearing wigs forever. Mm-hmm. Yeah, well, Coco, because yeah, she, uh, honey, she's been because she's been wearing wigs forever, ever and ever. And that's the thing, and she's gonna have the good wigs, so it's not even gonna be a <laughs> issue. Was, right? Maybe that one will burst into flames. <laughs> I'm trying to find it for y'all. That's the one you like. Yeah, the one with okay. he does the rain. Right. He does umbrella. Right. But he does sing it in the rain first, and that's really cute. You know, exactly. <laughs> I love him. Exactly, Carol. He has to get y'all a, uh, get y'all a, because it ain't, it ain't real if it ain't got a, a, a helicopter involved. No. It is not real until you have a helicopter involved. 
I watched it on here. That's why I'm confused. Why I can't find it. What did it maybe check that one? That's just for a lot of stuff. Maybe that's yeah. Let me see. Mm, maybe they took it down. I know they had the other one. Cause I can't find it. I can't find the lip sync battle with him. Ah. Uh, yeah, I like the one with the guy from Spider Man, Tom Holland, and he does Second right. in the Rain and then Rihanna's umbrella, and it's amazing right. because he dresses as Rihanna for the second part. Right, that's a good one too. Okay. And he's an excellent dancer, so. Oh, okay. Hold on, let me see if I do this right. Okay, there we go. I think I found it. I think I found it. No, that's not the full thing of it, though. Let me see if this is it. See, what are they doing? That's not even the song. Right? This the is crazy. Is <laughs> this is <laughs> crazy. Wait a minute. Right. See, this is like 36 oh, seconds. I cannot oh. find it. That's 54. It should be like two or three minutes. Yeah. Okay, we can't find it. It seems like it has been taken down. I'm looking Which forward. Is Cause I see this one. See, uh, that's the recap. Okay, so they've taken it down because I cannot find oh, it. Nice. And that's one of the best ones. So anyway, let's just keep talking. I tried. Right, I wonder what, what okay, at this point, I th you know what I think honestly probably happened? I think back in the 60s because she wore those wigs for so long she probably had traction alopecia because you know they were not taking care of her hair mm. probably right underneath those mm. wigs you know That's what i'm saying too, is that so 60s. i bet you from the 60s and how bad they didn't they probably didn't take care of her mm. hair well i bet you she ain't got that much hair yeah, I bet you she don't. Stuck them on and them See, off. there we go. Patience with us. I think she is because she wore them back in the 60s. And, you know, people get traction alopecia all the time, even now. So you can imagine. Yeah, they weren't putting them on in the most careful ways. Right. You know, they weren't careful with them. They was probably slapping them wings right. on her and she was wearing them constantly. Right. And they probably I didn't do. care either because it was like, well, we want you to look like this. So you're right. wearing it whether you want to or not. Right. So. Exactly. Suck well, you know Barry ran that place like. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we suck it up, buttercup. And but she can afford surgery now. But I bet you, I bet you, they really can't do a lot with Probably that. Probably not. No, they have to. I mean, you talking about some serious stuff going on, yeah. and she can just pop on one of her wigs. Yeah. <laughs> she's so used to yeah, wearing wigs. Well, and the thing is, she's gonna have the best wigs that right. are possible, so it's gonna look good no matter what. You know why Tracy came out with that hair care line? Because honestly. She's known for her hair, and we buy hair care products. Let's be honest. Black women, we see, especially the natural hair crew. It's a new product coming out. We're going to try it. Because honestly, 15,000 pattern hair tutorials, reviews since it came out. I said I'm going to try it, though, because she has the smaller she stuff. She does have gorgeous hair. She does. I mean, listen, I do love her hair. Hey, 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 give me some. <laughs> She was See, about to drink it all up. Have any, and now we still got wine. We're no. fighting over it, so yeah. I just I had bought two bottles last week. So right, they, it, uh, right. There we go. I'm gonna like, 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 take the rest. Mm -hmm. Take the rest. No, I do love her hair. Now, here's my thing. I'm not going to say she's my hair girl. I would like some of her length because my hair is never going to look like hers. But her yeah, her hairline is a money grab, of course. Mm -hmm. But isn't hers a little more relaxed? I personally think she's probably got a uh, texturizer in that baby, but that's just my I wouldn't. I think it's shrinkage isn't as much, right? Well, some people don't, cause um, like my cousin, she when, but it, obviously I know nothing about black. No, hair, so. <laughs> my cousin has hair similar to Tracy's, and so Which, when she lets it grow out, so yeah. Well, actually, my cousin's hair is a little bit looser curled than hers. Okay. Y'all would never know, but my mama has straight hair. Not with this nappiness on here. Well, because you know for a long time that not Carol's daughter. Who's the other one? Miss Jessie's hair. Oh. But you do know that Miss Miss Jessie's hair, um, care. They used to put texturizing in people's hair and they didn't know it. Did y'all know that? 
there was a there was a low key scandal about them about that. Because remember, Miss Jessie's was the first hair care line that came out that was really about natural hair and curly hair. Um, yeah, you know, heard, I've even heard of that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, that was a white girl, when right? I <laughs> but you know, they had a salon, and it came out that they were that they were a relaxer. Or Something. Oh yeah, they were putting they were putting mild texturizing people's hair to to mm, to, it to stretch out the curls. Yep, came out years ago. Yep, they were doing that for years. It came out finally. I think somebody who worked there finally so so they were like put like in the conditioner a very a small amount of and put it in so it wouldn't be enough to like to you wouldn't feel it. to notice it, but it would stretch out your hair. Couldn't so that's why everybody's right. Like oh. Wow. No, not their products, not their products, Bella. But if you're in the salon. but when they their salon, because you know their products came from their salon, and everybody was saying, you know how you know they came there and their hair was looking so beautiful and everything, and it came out that they were putting a, a small amount of relaxer in the deep conditioners. I suppose because then people would buy the stuff at home and go, how can my hair? And when they like, right, and well, well, you know, did. because people was buying it, then they were like, oh my yeah. god, it, it was the catalyst for them having their hair care line. Mm -hmm. And then if they weren't putting it in the stuff you're buying, they were like, what's going now, on? Because you remember the sister like killed that? herself. One of them killed herself. Really? Yep. Okay. Yep. There's a little touch of relaxer. That uh, yeah. So it was never in the products. It was it, what they were doing in the salon to prove, you know, like how it was like their, right. Well, it was like, oh, this is our method and we use our products and this is how your hair is going to come out. This is how you're going to Yep. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. So that's what they used to do. That it came out. Nobody really talked about it. Yeah. You know, that was before social media was hot. So people didn't really hear about that. It would have been now. Oh, yeah. And their brother would have no. Oh, yeah. Like Honestly, seconds. though, seriously, a lot of, there's low key, a lot of black stylists do do that because they don't want to deal with natural hair. So they want to soften it some. So a lot of them do that. That's why you have to watch them. Don't get your deep head in condition because they will fuck up your hair. Because that's their way of straighten out your hair enough so that it's not a problem right you found the video yes yeah Coco they do that I've heard of that right yep they they sure will they will put some see learn something new huh I do see coming around to you all the time because I know nothing about this stuff yeah I'm I don't my hair that is just I only go to the Great people that I know. Yourself. Like I, I go to my little, my Iraqis. I go see Kadir. You remember, did you remember Kadir, my neighbor? Did, did Kadir ever come upstairs? Oh, okay, he never came upstairs. Kadir, my neighbor. He he does the, the salon he works at. They do my hair. I haven't been to a salon in forever. I color my hair myself. I don't think the last time I've been to a salon was two years ago. Right. And my mom cut it the last time. I've heard of Uncle years. Funky's daughter's Uncle Funky's daughter hair products. Yes, I have. Right. Right. I think I might try it because she has the the nine dollar sizes as opposed to pay, paying for the full size. She does have the sample sizes. Even though I find nine dollars a lot for yeah. a sample, that's a lot, man. That is. That's a lot of her travel sites. Oh, is Do she? Do you have any of that? That's um, cool, Patience. Her daughter's one of the faces of Uncle oh, Funky's cool. daughter. Cool. Uncle Funky's Do they daughter. have any of it on the you can get hair it thing for Ulta? That they have? I don't think like Uncle, 21 days of... I don't think Uncle Funky's daughter oh, is... Oh, the other one. The, the... Pattern, they just came out. She just came out. The... Tracy Ross one. Yeah, she just brought it out. So it might be. I knew that they were. It's at Ulta. Yeah. And they're doing their 21 days of hair right. stuff, I think. Have they started the 21 days of hair? I don't think they've started it yet, but I know I got the catalog. Like, See, I need a damn catalog. <laughs> I, got the, I got the thing the other day. Yeah, we need to see how much these healthy minis are. Because I need it to be like at least, I'm sorry, I think it should be four ounces. <laughs> For $9, I'm going to need four ounces. Because yeah. I'm going to well, need to use it for a while. of those are crazy. I mean, even just like the regular shampoo and yeah. conditioner stuff for my hair that doesn't need anything special is right. Like, 
Wait, what? Yeah, when you get into the Olaplexes oh, and the yeah. Living Proof and all that. Yeah. yeah okay. And I don't even like half of those. Things. See, I need to get on Alta's ass because they do not send me my stuff. They gonna have to start sending me my my mailers. I need my mail. Yeah, I think it. I don't know when it's starting, but I know I. Have I it. think I got. The she mail said next week. week. It usually. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's another. Mail. But I'm just going. I look like I got money. Well, I'm sure it's probably thing. like it's probably like three ounces at the most. And most of the 21 days thing is like, here's 57 different flat irons we have on sale. <laughs> right. And blow dryers. Man, okay. Okay. But yeah. I do want to try. What did I see the other day? I was like, I think I might want that. And it's one of those blowout brushes. So the six through the twenty-six for the hair stuff. Oh. One of those blowout Hi, brushes. Hey Karen. <laughs> I do want one of those. I see you before you say hello. You love the chair? I bet you do. Oh, I got to put the, the thank you note on it. Because I'm planning on taping the, the thing that came with it. I'm afraid um, she's going to hurt herself one of these days. But we'll see. <laughs> I'm not going to hurt She can make myself. a viral video. Of I am not going to hurt myself. <laughs> I am not. I'm telling you. Oh, this is... Coco, you don't know. This is, oh, for the people who came in late, this yes. is Lisa Springer. Hi. This is Lisa Springer. Yes. So if you see me, I'm one of the ones with the wrenches that's in there every so often. She's of hanging time. out with me. She's spending the night with me so we can, and we're meeting up with Boothang Ledessa so we can go to the Maybe. makeup show tomorrow. Yeah, she, she gets her. Yeah. Well, she's going to she make it. Going. No, no, she's going to make it there. We're just seeing if she's going to make it there at night. Right. With the full fix. Right. Hi, patients. Hi, Coco. Right. See, that's Lisa. Yes. Yeah, we introduced at the beginning, and some of the people know who I am, but. Right. I know, patients. <laughs> you want to go? You want to go? I know. I'm excited. Yeah. <laughs> right. This is our first one. This is my second one. It's, yeah. It's Karen. 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 Do you want to go? She no. said we have to have faith that she's going to be on time with mm -hmm. a full beat face. And she yeah. wants a big hug. And we're like, Okay. <laughs> right. Um, excuse me, Bella, because it's at 9 a.m. on a Sunday. Were you going to be able to make it? I thought you said you were going to look and see if you could get a ticket. Right, right. I just bought Lisa's ticket because she needed to come with me. Because yeah, I'm not a professional. Because she's not a professional. And then well, I bought the I'm like, like, oh, yeah, I want to go. I don't know yet what I want to get. I I know brushes. We wanted to look at brushes, right? But it's kind of like Hi, what under I see because I don't know what what all they're gonna have. So. Hey, Janine. Oh, we talked about all kinds of stuff. Hi, Anna. So, so yeah, I want to see what the jelly. You can still is. come. They got tickets. You can come. Yes. Right. You can come. And then I can prove to Michelle you're not a bot. So anyway. Yeah, okay, I want to look, look at deli um, tools. I, we want to look at brushes. Brushes are a big thing. And I kind of okay, right. Like I told her, and this one is kind of small. <laughs> that is me. <laughs> right, okay. you can meet us there. Um, they have... Uh, no, it's not going to be any Japanese no. brushes. It's like crown You know what? Um, the okay. Chicago show is really small. Because we're not a huge market. So the Chicago small show is really small. Smith is going to be there. Bedellium is going to be there. Crown is going to be there. That are all brush companies. And it's all professional too. So right. that's, that's the other thing. We're not going to get as many people um, in there. That's why I have to go with Lou. Because I... So she has a, the YouTube channel that counts as being professional. So right. She can get one guest things. So right. I get to have that. I'm very excited. Right. So, Bella, can we come up with something that you got? You have something. You got stuff, though, that you can do. It. Yeah, because you were you did the, stuff before. And don't you do? Um, <laughs> Bella, go to, you know what, Google the Makeup Show Chicago. And it'll come right up. And you can buy the mm -hmm. tickets. I think they're, they were like 42 when I looked. Um, you can park. It's like at Ravel Hall. It's West Loop. It's the West. It's like West. Um, yes, yes. I think Smith is the one that makes the arrow shaped shadow brush. Um, I think it is. Um, the B is back. It's like on Fulton, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, it's, it's like West Fulton. Fulton. Yeah, it's on Fulton West Fulton. So it's on. So there's parking on. There's on street parking. It's like like a little bit west of Halsted. I have no idea. 
I'm talking about Bella. Talking about. <laughs> I was like, I have no idea. No. So, yeah. I know the Loop and Lakeshore and Michigan Avenue. And that. Right. And so, that's about it. So, it's not like the biggest show, but here's the thing. Um, they have, but I'm going to tell you who has a good one is um, Crown Brush. Cause I have one from them like that. Like it's kind of almost like an arrow shape. I have one from Crown Brush, and it ain't that expensive. Mm -hmm. no, um, one of those so the big ones that come there, cause this, like I said, this is a really small show. Um, oh, let me tell you. Um, there's a couple Carol that you can get. I don't find fan brushes are cute if you're good with them. Oh, you saw the bee. <laughs> You said we had a little too. Bees are, bees are okay. Bees are good for the environment. And girl, let you see. Girl, I can't find it we right don't now. Have those, so. Girl, don't act. I can't. I don't know if I can find it in that shell. Let me see. I don't did know if I can find one of those. I don't know if I did. I Coco. know you had one because you were playing. Yeah, with yeah. Coco, I don't know if I can find it now. How about this, Coco? If I see it at the uh, show, I'll pick it up for you. It's only like two or three dollars. I got you. I did get to see the makeup brush collection and hi, De hi, Kate. Hi. I really like them too. I really like crown brushes too, and yeah, they, they, they have the pro ones there. I got mm -hmm. mine off the whole thing. And, and so okay, so what they have the is they have. they have the crown brushes there. I am buying more brushes tomorrow. That, that's what I'm going. That's what I really want is. So, okay. So here's what they finally come to the side of, and they don't have to wash them if they have brand new ones. Yeah. I need some new face brushes. I want Which some more, brush, mm -hmm. I want some more blush brushes and I want a couple more bronzer brushes. Girl, the AB23 is bomb. I just got it. Coco, you are never lied. Where is it at? I just washed it. And I know I look last night to see about the but, of palettes and they still have the ten dollar brushes too. right but buy it from abh buy something from it and you get ten dollar mm -hmm. brushes yes so when you make an order you can and get a ten dollar brush they had it last night so i'm assuming that's still they've had it for a while yeah they keep so. doing it i'm assuming you want the hakahodos yeah i ain't got <laughs> hakahodo money yeah no I ain't gonna have to hold on money. So what I think I'm gonna wind up, what I'm looking for um, is they have, but I also like, it's not out here. Stelazi has a really nice brush that works with dense highlighters. So, yeah, see, that's what I'm saying, Joshua. Joshua, we right here. Yes, exactly. Tammy and Bella and I oh, are you didn't know very you did? much onto that. Because I should did. That's how I bought this one. Because I bought the A23 because I had been wanting it. So I got my A23. Um, but like Chicago is a pretty small market. So there we have Smashbox, Stila. Um, Friends comes. Uh, yeah. Friends comes. Friends Beauty Supply comes. And they come hard. They and come Muse. and Muse Beauty Muse Pro, with Vizar, right? Vizar, Vizar, right. Vizar, Muse Beauty Pro comes. So they, those are the ones that come with a lot of product. Um, so you can get some decent deals there. Um, Stila gives you fifty percent off, but they don't bring product. So they bring, they give you a, a code for fifty percent off. So if they give the fifty percent code, I'll give y'all that too. I would do that if you bought it and then you didn't get it. I would do that, Coco. I would ask them, yo, yeah, can we do this? Because they've done it a lot. Right. And then, um, yeah, that's been kind of consistent. They've been doing yeah, that $10. I, mean, I think. Because I said I wanted to pick up another, if I buy another ABH thing. Because when they go on sale, I, I'm going to buy some more lipsticks at Black Friday. Because, you know, I'm on my lipstick thing. Y'all know I got a two lipstick thing. And I'm going to buy the, the Luminous Foundation. I'm going to try it there. Oh, yeah. Okay yeah and but I, yeah so it out because it's a cute little one i know you're talking about it's like a little arrowy kind of vibe mm -hmm. so i'm gonna get a smith a couple of smith brushes to try i want to we want to try bedellium mm -hmm. we, i'm definitely gonna grab a whole bunch uh um mm -hmm. you can get dark mats and visor yes and we're not sure if they're gonna 
have it. No, there. they will have the dark mats because that's the oh, eight that's pack. the old one. Right? Yeah, it's the new ones that are. Well, they're gonna have ABH with Friends. So Friends brings ABH and they bring everything. Um, so they're like Mark Jacobs, none of that. Kevin Aquan's gonna be there. Yeah, Kevin Aquan. So I want to try to see what kind of prices they got on Kevin yeah. Aquan. Because you know that ain't going on soon. Well, you know <laughs> all the crown brushes are natural hair. The pro brushes are all natural hair. Coco. Okay, Coco, contact me. If you want a bunch of brushes, contact me. We'll be in, I'll have to email, contact you tomorrow. Maybe we'll messenger. Because then I'll go, when I'm hitting crown, and then you can see what you want. You can just, like, cash at me. Because mm -hmm. I got folks cash at me now. <laughs> I need that. Right. I did hear that foundation yeah. bomb is crap. I did yeah, hear you have to like use their brush and all that. Yeah, I ain't doing all that. No. Yeah, no, that's what I want. Is the sensual skin and hair? Yeah, that's supposed to be. Right I want to try that. That's what I want to try. Yeah, everybody I've heard about that uh, that foundation bomb. It sounds terrible. But can I say this? When have cream count foundations like that ever been that good? Let's just be honest. Them pots of cream, never good. I guess they're good for makeup artists. Mm -hmm. And I mean, right? You gotta kind of wonder with Kevin Aquan. Oh, you got the not, Sonya G. Oh, you got the Sonya <laughs> not G. Not there anymore. That you know, yeah, Kevin kind of, Well, Kevin Aquan been gone forever. Well, yeah, but you know, they're just coming up with stuff and slapping his name on it. Linda, you want to try the the Urban Decay Foundation? That's a good foundation. I love this that foundation. And I've done one of my Lulu Minute makeup on it. <laughs> okay, so let's talk. Let's talk. I got 32 people in here. Let's talk. <laughs> Listen, I need y'all to share me out to your networks. Put me on your Facebook page. All that other bullshit. Find a good one that you like and send it to people. I think Lulu needs another cocktail. <laughs> Right. I mean, like, of course, the cream is good for stage, of course. I do like the dose of colors. Of course, that color was a little off for me. It is a little, it was a little light. It was, it was a little light. light. Yeah, it was too light for me. Right now. Because <laughs> usually it's the opposite. From no, I thought it was too light. It was too light. Right, and drag. Usually, usually it's the honey thing that gets you, not the light thing. Yeah, that was the one time I went too light. No, I went too light when I let Sephora do me. They were like, yeah, use this. And I looked like a floating head. <laughs> it was just this floating pale ass head. So in other words, I Keep your budget under 100. Oh, I don't know if I can do that. My budget isn't that high. But okay, let me say how much I spent last time. Yeah, my husband tried to tell me that he's like, I don't get too okay. much. I'm like, okay. Okay. <laughs> Um, okay. Um, just, do you have my number, Bella? I'll send it to you. Um, oh, that Sephora Foundation Finder is complete trash. You know what I do, though, with it? Actually, let me say this. Yeah, my Juvia's place was too light, too. You're right. You're right. You're right. And y'all told me to get that Every one. Every once in a while. But I'm going a little darker. I'll send it to you. But, um. Although the last two, I think I spent perfect, so we can't get. I spent uh, last time like two fifty, about two fifty last time I went, and I bought quite a bit though. I did buy a lot, cause I don't think I'm going to. Uh, I don't think I'm going to buy any lashes. Maybe. Oh, you don't like the Juvia's uh, foundation? It seems a little high coverage. No, it's not. Right, I was going to say, you leaving Bella? Oh, no, she's meeting us at the makeup show. All right. Now, we're going early. Okay, so let me just tell her the, the truth. Okay, okay, so, Bella. This is important. From 9 to 10.30 a.m., they're having specials. A lot of the vendors Big are having, spots. like, sales. So, that's why we're going to be there at 9 a.m. Bobby yeah, Brown has not been. her ticket. She said. Okay, okay. All right. Yeah, make sure. So we're meeting there. We're getting there at 9 a.m. because they're having sales. 
So, because I got the email. The, like the busy art, the new one was right. on sale and all that stuff. And, right, um, right. So the busy art Grand Pro 3 is going to be on sale. Super sale. Yeah. like More than 20%. Like 50 bucks off. Or yes, like $50 yeah, like off. Yeah, it's crazy. So we want to get there for all of that fun. Now, I'm not getting the buys art. No. And I probably won't right. either because that's just not. I know you would, patient. I'm not getting that because I, didn't I got all the Norbinas. So I'm good on colorful palettes. I don't call you a bot. I just call you shady. <laughs> Michelle is the one that calls you the bot. I met you before. Or your I saw that Lou or you your verified that you were not a bot. Michelle, however, thinks Patience, you, you want the Visor Grand Pro, the three? Contact us. We might have to get you one. Well, okay, we're trying to see if there's any limits on it. They have like 50 people. Right, right. Here's the busy art. Right. Because it's 125. Like, seven pallets. Thank you. <laughs> so. Because, if, right, I'll be like, can I have 10 pallets, please? Be um, like, because yeah. it's 125 at the show. Yeah. That's why we're going. That's why you know, cause I got yeah. one. Hour, I got to buy one already. I got a con. I got a few other people who are trying to get. The so color, we're trying the to find out. Is the new one? Yeah, the number the one three. That's gonna be on sale. Yeah. So we're trying to find out. Are there any limits? Cause they didn't say limits. <laughs> well, he didn't look to see. If no, it didn't say limits. Oh, it didn't say limits. Okay. Yes, Melissa. What? I know Shell should know that you're a real person, but she just likes to find out. She's never seen. Her. <laughs> you know we mess with you badly. You know we have to mess with you. If you just get I'm, a babysitter that would come and uh, right, and not cancel it right. the last second. But let problem. me say this: on my birthday, y'all got twenty twenty. Oh, but that's IMAX too. I was gonna say, aren't you on IMAX on your birthday? So, uh, no, my IMAX is IMAX is after. Oh, my that's birthday. right. It's after your birthday. You, you, you want well, the you, you want the dark man? Yeah, it's usually after my birthday. It usually comes like we got them. Um, uh, okay, you want the dark mat. Okay, so the dark mat Muse Beauty Pro. But let me say this: don't don't rush. Here's what you need to do. If you ain't got it today, Kate, the dark mats get on Muse Beauty Pro's um, email list because they do twenty percent off eyes are all the time. Yeah, and they do like a buy one get one. Right, like yeah, something. yeah. They'll do like they always do deals on eyes are. Yeah. So I know that at the show it's no um the, it only goes down like twenty percent. That's across the board. So how are you doing, Kate? Now I yeah. want the dark edit. So if they have the dark edit and that's only thirty nine dollars, if they have that for twenty percent off. And I'm you can it. watch Sephora too, because I got the dark mats on yeah, Sephora sale. last year and it was when they had the twenty percent off too, I think, or something. It was crazy it was like 60 something when i got it see i've never tried to every well I, so, i'm i'm not as much uh i've got a whole list of i need to make my whole list of foundations i need to try i still have to go get my charlotte tilbury the new one the flawless filter one that she's done i gotta get that one i still need to get the um yeah i yeah friend they only give 20 percent, so i'm like mm -hmm. Now, friends will have ABH. So AB, they said they're going to have ABH. I'm going to be mad if they have the Norvina palettes. <laughs> but I did them And all. I will be happy. I know you will. <laughs> because be they're sad, supposed to have it. I will be like, yes. So. Right. They, right. Now, right, now, I paid full price for that damn safari. Well, you know they're going to start having sales once they switch over the points because they're going to have to keep up with the Oh, time. yeah. They're coming. Yeah. They they already starting. Oh, yeah. And Ulta's already going crazy with their stuff, too. Mm-hmm. Yes, Kate! Awesome, Kate. That... Yeah. Okay, let's just all say... Yes. Let's just give Kate... Yes, we are so happy yeah. that you're doing good. You know, we are so happy that you're doing good. I'm happy to hear that. Yes. I'm so happy for you. I think my cousin had wanted to come, but, you know, Ayana lying. Ayana, my cousin oh, yeah. Ayana. Yeah, you said that last week and then Ayana wanted to go back. Ayana bought a bunch of Juvia's Place palettes. They never put them on her eyes. I said, we're going to have to come <laughs> over there and I'm going to have to teach you how to use them. I should tell her to send me some money for some brushes. She sh she swears she got brushes. And she probably does. She just don't know what to do with them. <laughs> I am so happy for you, Kate. Yes, that's awesome. So 
So I, I'm up. I, see, drinking and talking woke mm-hmm. me up. Yeah, for the ready moment. To crash oh man, I was about to pass the like, fuck out. Better go loud because I'm tired. Because, see, that's why I wind up coming on late, though. Because when I come home from work, I usually, it's about 6.30-ish, and I pass out. <laughs> so, it looks like we finished both bottles. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's, 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 yeah. We actually have more in there, but I don't know if we should drink that, because it's been sitting out. <laughs> God. It's really tremendous. Because <laughs> I didn't have any more bottles, so I'm just going to toss it out. But... <laughs> And still sit down, I'm just saying. Mm-hmm. And four bottles of wine on the floor over here. <laughs> yeah, and we got an open bottle over there. And then five. So we have five bottle, unopened bottles. The chanting wears me out. Let me tell you the funniest thing about the chanting. <laughs> so the guy said, Hey, she said, wasn't even there yesterday for the chanting and it wore out. <laughs> right. He said, you know, y'all could come up with a new chant. If somebody has a new chant, everybody looked at them and was like, oh, you go say, go ahead and drink the fermented liquor that's been sitting out for a week. Girl, no. I'm about to toss that shit. Because it hasn't been in the refrigerator. Yeah, I'm not drinking it. <laughs> she could try it, but I'm not drinking it. Not doing it. I got a show to go to tomorrow. I do not need to be in this house throwing up. Ah, this is Coco's fault. I should have never listened to her. Ah. No, thank you. It's not going to happen. Mm-mm. This is it for me. It for me. Mm-hmm. Right, exactly. Patience, I know. I know. No, it's not happening. Not happening, not happening, not happening. No, she's got to get up. She's got to take B to work. Right. First, I got to get up and take B to work at 6 30 in the morning. Then I got to come home and get ready. Right. If I decided to drink that, there would be like, okay, now we might need to put you in a program. I'm just saying. She's seeing shit. (laughs) I have not tried the Dior yet. I keep forgetting to buy it. That is on my list to try. I need to start making my list again of foundations I want to try. What was um, the one you got the sample for when we went? Chanel and oh, I. Chanel, okay. And I still ain't used Like, it. I knew it was Chanel or Dior. I right, sure right. One. I'm probably going to need to go and do that. Mm-hmm. It's called to wake you up. Okay, well. We, so, yeah, you need to inbox me your number then. Because I am awake. I will be up by 545. I'm going to have to call Ledessa, too. I'm calling her too. <laughs> she don't know it, but I'm calling her phone at 7 a.m. Hey, I'm going call. I'm gonna call her when I'm on the way home from taking B. But I'm getting up at 5:45. I'm gonna take my shower and stuff, right? Cause Karen know. See, Karen know Ledessa. Karen knows that she. Yep. Karen and I both know how Ledessa is with that. Me too. Do you like the sun kiss face palette? I told you, girl, Coco, ain't it cute? I told you. That is such an underhyped product. No one talks about it. No Nobody one talks about the lime cream at all anymore. No one really does. It doesn't seem like right. It. I mean, they did a little bit with the, that like neon palette. Right, right, with, but right. That was it. Right. They didn't do much on the Immortals one that just came out. No, we haven't heard anything about the Immortals. Right, Coco. It's so it was so much better than I expected. The bronzer is nice. I mean, it's a really good, it's a really good solid face palette. It's a really good solid face palette. I gotta do, I'm getting into my minute makeup things because you see I'm doing more editing and everything. So I, I got a couple more in my head that I gotta do because I'm trying to make sure I put them out. The thing with IG, you gotta push it out every day. So that's Ooh. how sorry. I'm not ready for this. Yes, she not. did. Yes, yes, exactly. Um, Tara, Tara did say that it's better than expected. Yes. Yes, the immortality, she said, is better yes. than she thought it was. But you know what? She the, said that the finger swatches were bad. That's what she went on and then she the, tried it. Right, but the reality is sometimes finger swatches, because some of the finger swatches on the Norvina ain't that great, but yeah. it really works. What? Did to, right, mm-hmm. Yeah, they yeah they still trying to do dear. Yeah, she did do a whole lot. That's why they got rid. Yeah, she was smart enough to sell a brand. Yeah, 
that was that's the only reason why I'm buying now is because she's not in it. Yeah, see, the Immortalis is pretty, but I'm not. I don't wear cool tones enough. I don't wear colors like yes, that yeah, enough. Yeah, so I'm talking right, about but see, that works for you. I am bright browns, oranges, greens, blues, pinks, pinks. Pinks and, do, and purples, purples pinks and purples, pinks and purples, pinks and purples. Because what do we love? The Venus, Venus. XL. <laughs> that is such a great palette. And the pink Venus. And the pink, and the pink Venus. Venus. Have you seen the, did you see the new one? The rose one? No. They've got a small one. Go look at them. It's coming out for holiday. I might have seen that. It's a I little, know. it's a little one like the XS rose Before. gold. But it's the rose yeah, one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. yes, I've got to get that one. Yes, I did see. And I went, oh, that one yes. the other one's Yes, and I'm getting all three of them because I want the green one and the blue one because you know I want the green and the blue. I am a green blue obsession person right now. I don't know what's about that, but you know, I got to obsess on them all. So, so we're all, you're all going to have to help me with my live miss plans because I need to really be on top of it because I can tend to procrastinate. I am an Aries. We procrastinate. Mm -hmm. So, so I have to turn the volume up on your phone so that we can call you when you fall asleep. <laughs> right, right, right. After you scheduled one and then it's already quarter mm -hmm. after the time you scheduled it and we go, hmm. I, I wonder know, if Lou fell asleep. I know I'm going to do um, yes, the mini her. Venus ones. Um, I think, okay, so I do know I'm going to do some morning ones like I've been doing where I'm getting ready for work. Mm -hmm. I know I'm going to do some of those. I know, but I am going to schedule a bunch of stuff. I know I want to do like almost a whole week of collections and declutters, lies mm -hmm. and deceit. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna do a declutter. Okay, just oh, get no. get ready for it. I'm doing an eyeshadow palette collection and declutter. You know, I'm I just I'm practicing. I'm practicing. But you should actually be overwhelmed with the amount that you have. Oh, Unlike the ones that have like 18 that are overwhelmed. You actually <laughs> might be overwhelmed, and it might actually be yes. a chance. Oh, yeah, you've seen the, 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 You've witnessed. I mean, I'm just as bad. I'm not saying right. that there's anything so, wrong so I'm going to like, be on there like this. I'm just overwhelmed. It's just too much for me. I just can't take it anymore. I just can't take Oh, you ain't getting that safari palette. I can tell you that. That would never do. That happen. Hannah chick would have a heart attack if she saw how many you had that you were going out of. You know, I'm like, you have that. I'm just so overwhelmed and I just can't feel, I can't, I, don't, I can't, I can't enjoy how them. How I can't even get I can't them. enjoy them. I can't enjoy them like, you know, I guess should. I can't enjoy I them. I have four palettes and it's just breaking me apart. Right, right. Uh, the one who said 18, because you saw the one who said 18? Uh, yeah. She's like, it's just too much. I have 18 palettes. And I'm like, yeah, Girl, I, got, I got all those palettes too, plus a bunch of Girl, wait, like, okay. Wait, wait, I can buy 18 in a month. Hello, oh, goodbye. Man. Talk to Danny. She bought 22. <laughs> oh, who's telling on Danny? She told us. We all know Danny has. Right? Danny is. Right, girl, right, exactly. She was like, it's just so overwhelming. And I just, it's just too much. I just. Yeah, no. But what's interesting, um, right, right, hold up. What was interesting is one of the people that I've watched do the whole, you know, declutter. I'm decluttering. I just don't, it's too much. Why is she doing videos of new eyeshadow palettes? So you decluttered and bought more. What the fuck? Yeah, but I mean, that's how that um, Jessica Moran is too. She buys all that stuff and then cuts it all down like a month later. Right, yeah. Jessica Moran does do that. You know, she's miscurating and she's always getting rid well, of and stuff. And she's one that she's like into that Marie Kondo stuff. And I'm like, how can you? I only have five lipsticks. How can you do both? Did she do like, because didn't she thing. declutter all her lipsticks down to five? Probably. And then she goes and buys more and it's like, are you. I mean, like you had said before, if you get it in PR, I can kind of understand it. I still would probably keep the ones that work for me. Well, yes, she did get most yeah. of her PR, but she's yeah. buying a lot. But she's so. buying stuff too, and it's like you're buying that. You right. bought it. You have it for like a month, and then you get. It wasn't that months. many more than five, though. The first time she decluttered, it wasn't that oh, many yeah. more. When she first started with the Marie Kondo, right. thing, she she cut like 
she cut she almost everything. Like Maybe ten. very minimal. Very yeah, minimal it was amazing. It was like, like I ain't doing it. Really? I'm like that doesn't bring you. I, I don't know. All my palettes bring me joy, so. But you know she's making enough. Yeah, yeah she's I mean, brutal and she's brutal with it and everything. Right. Like, but even you know Samantha R- Ramadan is going on a three month no no buy because she says she, she's at least like I'm going on three month no buy. I don't know how I'm gonna do this kind of thing. Right, she's but at least like, but, I'm, I'm but I mean like I don't think I'm gonna do this. But I you know I appreciate hers because she says since she got rid of all the PR, she spent what eight thousand dollars on makeup. Jesus. You know. um let me tell you something. I ain't never doing Marie Kondo. I oh, could just God, be. No. No. I, no. I Thank you. I would be bored to death with a minimal uh-huh. collection. It would just be like, okay. Because you know what? If I don't have a lot, then I can't do anything. Because it'll be like, I don't want to use that now. I don't want to. In my and head, it, if it? I don't have a, if, you know, if I don't have a certain amount, I'm going to be like, when I look at them, it's going to be like, now I'm bored. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? And I, I know that's crazy, but it's the truth. Oh, no. I, I totally agree with you. And I mean, that's the thing. There's like, I mean, because oh, like, you should look at it and decide if it gives you joy. Yeah, every freaking palette that every I have gives me joy. Thing <laughs> I got gives every me joy. Every thing I bought. Right. See, joy. Linda said it's everything. Yes. I wouldn't have bought it if it didn't yeah. give me joy. So, yeah. Right. When I look at it, I'll be like, oh, that shit is pretty. I yes. want it. I want it. Yeah. I even when I go through stuff and I'm like, should I get rid of this? Oh, no, I can't get rid of this. This is too cute. Look at this. Right, exactly. <laughs> Hi, Jordan. You're new. You're new. Welcome, welcome. Hello. I'm a little tipsy tonight. Mm-hmm. Which is always fun. Tipsy Lou is always fun. Um, Samantha Ravendahl. Yeah, I was But I mean, that- she's a larger YouTuber, yeah. so her doing that ain't shit. I'm surprised that she... Got rid of her all the PR though. But I thought that was interesting. Mm-hmm. I thought that maybe she I mean, should. I um, to be honest, <laughs> I would have thought she should have just told, dealt with her PR in a day. Like say, you need to contact me, and I'll let you know if I want the right. PR. Or, or I want only like if you're gonna send me foundations, I just want the colors that are gonna fit me. Right, or, right. You know, so I don't that, and I don't need the higher. And Sad I don't order. want, um, oh no, oh, here we go. Oh. Um, or say, I don't want the PR packages. Just right. send me the product. Yeah, I don't need the video screen and the whole whatever. Right. Craziness that some of them. Yeah, you know, like, like I really had, what was it, like the mini fridge for one of them and stuff like that. Even though I do want that mini fridge, maybe. Was but not it, but it wasn't like a real one, though. It was just like... Oh, it wasn't even the no. mint real one? Oh, it just looked like a mini fridge? Yes. Oh, that ain't shit. But because, like, Anastasia gives... I wouldn't want all that crap they give with those PR packages. No. I just I mean, want the product. Are, just send me the damn product. I don't need the boxes. I don't need none of that shit. What is a bubble like, wrap? You know, have ones with, like, video screens in it? Yeah, just yeah. play, like, their one little... Right, thing. right. Like, why do you need to put a video screen? In? Right. It's just going to get tossed and... Nobody cares anyway. I want the mini fridge too. Of course you do, Joshua. I would love the mini fridge. I keep saying that because Brandon was always my favorite because he would go downstairs and get me sodas out of the fridge. <laughs> so I said for Christmas he needs to buy me a little mini fridge to have by my bed so that I don't have to go downstairs. No, we talking about, have you seen the I've seen the ones for the makeup too, but I want to uh, have mini both. I can have but my see, makeup, is, but yeah, it's I, so but see, I want, if I got the bigger one, it would have to be pink and, you know, that's what I want. Well, they that's some cute ones. That's why I like the cute mini fridges. I don't want the, they've got some really cute ones. they got like the little old fashioned looking like Frigidaire ones that are right. like from the 50s that are like the blue or the, the, you know like, what I used to have one of those green ones. color ones yeah. in my old house in my old I life. Have one of them. Well, I wish I'd known you. I threw it away because I have one. Oh, the old. The, mm-hmm. Yeah, my grandma had one of those. And it was like it had the uh, wood panel side to it. It was so. It was so. Cool. One of my friends, she's got all the fifties era stuff in her kitchen. She's got the old refrigerator she's got the old stove the whole thing it's all i'm sorry jordan we talk about beauty skincare all kind yeah. of crap it depends on where we at you know you never know what's going to happen on this channel right just now, go ahead just go ahead whatever. and subscribe and watch right 
Yeah, they do cocoa. They have some really cute ones. The Walmart even had them, I think, and they were like forty. But they were under yeah, they, bucks. yeah, yeah. You could get, yeah, you, like, could get oh, a, you could get a, a, a mini fridge pretty cheap now. Remember when mini fridges, you know, are, were so expensive? They were like hundred. Yes, they were getting. We they were getting, like, we they were getting so over. Remember, they were renting them to people at the. That's the, what we had. We had. Yes. You could, well, you could buy them, but you could rent them from the school, and they would have them in your dorm when you came in. Right. Because otherwise, they were like hundred, like two hundred right, bucks. Right. Exactly. So like, uh, what am I going to do with it when I'm done? Right. Exactly. I mean, yeah, I probably could have found maybe something to use it for, but right. Yeah. But they were getting over, and the school oh, they were getting over. Insane. And it was like, well, okay, well, yeah. We <laughs> remember that we if the kitchen once. comes with a '50s woman, <laughs> and now. I know, like Brandon's, his comes with the microwave and his right. comes with the refrigerator. He's even got a bathroom in his dorm. Well, room. room. In no. his room. No. He's got a shower and a toilet and a sink. And I'm like, oh, no, y'all not ready. When B first went to school, she went to GW, George mm -hmm. Washington University in D.C. You know, that's oh, not yeah, the yeah. most expensive college. Mm -hmm. It's not. University. <laughs> she was in a suite and they had maid service. Okay, I was in a suite when I was in college my second year, and we had four girls, and we had the bathtub, the toilet, yeah. and the sink, and we thought we were living large. We were like, no, they had we don't have to go down the hallway no, they to had, go No, pee. they had maid, great. GW had maid service. Yeah, but at the time, maid it was, service. that was what, 2008, $60,000? Yeah, they had maid service. I would have yeah. loved maid service. I promise They you. wouldn't have loved us. GW has maid service for the... I still remember there was a night we went out. Then she came in like once or twice a week. We told and uh, I yeah. got a little ill in the sink <laughs> that was right next to the toilet. But I no, didn't but really we, care at that point. No, time. but let's let's just be honest. When you are in the moment and getting sick, oh yeah, you know, you just you doing good yeah, just to get to something like, you can clean it, it out. Hit something that's not hey anymore. exactly so that's a, and that's happiness because if you. Right. You know, if you're doing that, okay, see you in a minute, Coco. If you are doing that and you don't make it to, as long as it makes it to someplace that you can rinse out, and th that's a good thing. <laughs> Get you used know, to it, Bella. It's going to be for years. Right. Me. What are you talking about? They're not even. My kids are in college and they still fuck See, that's what I'm saying, Joshua. The sink is better than the floor because you can I just know, rinse yeah, it out. The only thing is it was sink toilet. I mean, it was like right there and they're like really you couldn't have made it the i'm like no you're lucky i made it to the sink because right. i don't even remember getting to the room so oh yeah we've had those things. oh yeah. my third when i was turning 30 that was what like that was what i was every time i went to somebody's 30th birthday party it was like we turned at 30 yeah. well my 21st my roommate had the same birthday as i did so we both had our 21st together okay well guess what that they, they can't clean well so this is so many yeah, i remember around my 30th <laughs> okay on my 30th that it was kind of a blur toward the end of the night but i went out for, to somebody else's 30th birthday party right before mine and me and donnie got so drunk i remember she had to stop the car on the side of the road so i could throw up and then we got to our house i think i threw up again and I I just apparently I passed out wrapped around the toilet because she woke up at one point and she said, Bitch, if you don't move, I'm going to pee in your face. So I just moved <laughs> back <laughs> so she can pee. <laughs> those are those are those nights that you go, I will never drink like that again. That's the one where I woke up. Oh yeah, home. Carol. George Washington University in DC does it. They have maids on this. I woke up in the hallway at one of the dorms there in Madison. Well, cleaning. So looking at the floor, going. Those huh. are those moments. That, but see, but and then, then I woke up the next morning. I'm like, why is my head hurt? And right. I had this huge do say because I must have just went not the floor. But here's the thing. Thank yeah. God we can say we did these things when we were young. Yes. Because and when you were this no age, no social, social media. media. I would have, oh Woo. my God. Woo. Yes. Yes. Because it would not have been. Yes. Happened. I tell people, I'm so glad I didn't grow up in the time of social media because I'm so glad there was no camera phones. I'm glad mm -hmm. all those things. Because the shit that I got into, I don't want nobody to remember but me. Mm -hmm. Well, and then in Wisconsin, I think it's still the case as far as I know is um, if you're with your parents you can be whatever age 
you want. Shut and up. as long as your parents are there, you can drink with them. So like when I was 19, I would go into the beer tents with my parents because you were with the parent. And then my parents would leave. And you would stay. And I would stay because it would be so packed that they wouldn't notice. Right, 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 right. And that's actually how I met my husband was when I was 19 in the beer tent when I was supposed Right, to right. That's when it was, you yeah. know. And, and then, they still have it today. I mean, like, I know Megan was going to go out with her lab and her doc, the doctor that runs her lab was like, you're my daughter tonight. You can have a beer if you want. Wow. <laughs> I'm, like, I'm like, all right, well, yeah, that's the way it is. See, and that's my thing. That's why yeah. I don't, like, nowadays people film you and shit. Oh, man. Yeah. Um, what but you know back when we were young you could do some crazy shit oh, people could yeah. talk about it oh. but you know ain't no physical evidence of it there is no yeah. pictures nope. no pictures nothing nowadays you can't do shit without somebody taking a picture oh, or filming no. your ass that i feel no. sorry for the young people now because we mm -hmm. had it good yes oh god you could do whatever you, you could do whatever yeah you might have stories told about you, but you could just deny it. And then you could move it. away and nobody would know. Yeah, you could just be like, oh, no, not me, no. Right. I mean, we used to drink in the parking lot at the high school <laughs> during basketball games and stuff. Yeah, everybody did that. I just didn't. But, you know. But, you know, it's like, like, for me, it's like, I remember doing stuff and it's like, ooh, okay. But I'm saying, yeah, like, it's cool that, like, but, you know, like, thank God we made it through. Yes. Thank God we made it through. Um, but... It's like nowadays yep, they exactly had so damn. much. I am exactly. so glad that I was not, and we were young enough mm -hmm. that we did. Hi, Tara. I've never seen you before. Um, and, yeah. and then we could do those things. At least we're we're mature enough to say, okay, that's good enough. We're not gonna do it anymore. And I because I cannot stand when I see old people. My what the fuck? That was the bee. That was the bee. I gotta go pee now. That shit fucking me. I'm done. She'll be back in a minute. The bathroom's right there, so it shouldn't take too long. But yeah. Oh, that was the bee. There's like one or two in here that have are like dopey from it being cold so they just kind of yeah <laughs> at least she didn't flip the chair so we are she didn't get hurt she just had to be coming at her <laughs> it probably has been drinking the old wine because it's not the brightest bee in the world we are having a lot of fun, Linda. It is, it's a good time. I have a lot of fun when I'm with Lou, so. I know, I came in today, I was planning on putting her chair together because we've been talking about this, that I'm like, well, if I come down there and it's not put together, I'm putting it together when I get there. Well, when I came in, it was already getting put together, so I dodged the bullet. I didn't have to try to figure it out because it looked like it was kind of work, so. I'm okay, glad so I'm trying good. to give this bee its life, keep it living. But if it hits me in the head one more time, it's over. I'm getting my I'm getting my Clorox out. I'm spraying <laughs> that bitch and it's gonna die today. Because we saying. know the Clorox will take the Clorox take anything out. Give me a paper towel and I will kill it. I killed a bunch of them when we were at the thing. Or at the um, <laughs> at the gender reveal. I, I was Angel's hero a, while we were here. I'm a little tipsy. See, that's the difference between somebody from Wisconsin and somebody from Illinois. I've had as much as Lou has, and I'm not near as tipsy as she is. Mr. B, your life is over. I tried to keep you living. Oh, gosh. Yes. Oh, she just got paper towel. I thought for sure she was getting the Clorox and we were going to be in trouble. But Who's going to get what? I thought you were getting the Clorox, but you no, just got no, paper towel. No, no, because I'm not going to okay. spray because I might spray you in the face All or right. something. All right. <laughs> True. That's probably the best idea that we got. The <laughs> they just said you were lightweight. <laughs> oh, I am. I admit that. I always have been. So, yeah, I said that's the difference between Wisconsin people and Illinois people. I've had the same amount as you have, but I'm not near as tipsy as you. No, that's because I haven't been drinking. There was a time when I could handle this. But See, let me tell you, I, gotta, I have to crack open a whole other one before I get to this level. So. 
It would be that a one isn't because she wants me to <laughs> pop open another one. Because. I just lost all track of what I was about to say. <laughs> was it about to be? I don't know. <laughs> okay, let me get it together. Mm-hmm. All I know is that damn bee hit me in the head. <laughs> if we're getting me on here for a little bit longer, I'm going to have to Do you see that? She's getting another one. We are, I, guess I already we're... explained. I'm from Wisconsin. I can handle a lot more. Besides, you have to try some of this because this is the stuff I brought. Okay, well, here's a glass. We're going to need some ice, probably. Oh, I don't care about ice, but okay, but if you insist, I will I will drink it. She you. wants to drink warm white wine. I, uh, I drink, well, because I'm a red wine drinker, so I'm used to drinking warm wine. I can't drink red wine. Oh, I'm not going to sleep through the alarm. Listen, the thing about me with all of this, I will be up early in the morning. Yeah. <laughs> Melissa, this cannot be come again. <laughs> Listen, See, you get hit, Melissa said hold up. Melissa. You get hit the head by me and it's going to be over. You go back the same way I did. Melissa said the other day we are kindred spirits. I believe that. <laughs> I totally believe that. That would be, yeah. <laughs> All I need is Tara in here. If Tara was in here, I'd already be a gift. I'm See, gonna have one glass. This for day. those of you that don't know, I have chronic migraines. So I have to take fairly powerful painkillers. So this kind of thing. Yeah. Although I probably won't have to take Oh, uh, that's it. Listen. <clears throat> I probably won't have to take the powerful painkillers tonight. Oh my god, this is really good. I don't know. Oh my god, this is really tasty, y'all. What is this? This is Wallersheim Winery's Prairie Fumé. Well, you gotta show it because I can't see it. You this, gotta learn how to be a yeah. YouTuber. This is Prairie. from a winery in Wisconsin. I don't know how wide their thing is, but I know that they have like case clubs that you can join and get cases of wine sent to you and things. Y'all can turn me into a gift about, you know, the bee, because the bee did take me out. But yes, Prairie Fumé is a very, very good thing. Because the bee did almost take me out. (laughs) I better get my paper towel in case it comes back. Because if it comes back. I don't know, last time I saw it, it flew over there somewhere. I know there's a dead bee up there I need to get rid of, because I noticed that this afternoon. There's a dead bee up there. <laughs> hey, I got the ch- yes. chair made. Let's let's just talk about that small miracle and my bed put together. So this was a good Saturday for me. Mm-hmm. And see if she passes out. She's already in the comfy chair. We're good. We'll just wheel her into the bedroom. Right. And dump her out. It's fine. Right. Okay. Exactly. You know, if I'm a little, just roll me into the room, flip me off the chair. I'm good. It's got me. Just had B, come and help me for a minute. Right. B, and B, you better move out of the way because your mom is coming. <laughs> and B will be angry. There she goes. Right. It's been a very productive day. Now, on a, on a professional level for a job, no, it has not. So I guess I'm going to have to do some grading tomorrow. I'll throw some grades in. Shit. Oh no, you know I'm a, I'm a one There's level. no stairs. You should have to go out the door to go to the stairs. Right, I have to go, so we're good, you know. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> <Yep. laughs> if that happens, I'll make sure to take your video. Don't I do worry. think I'm going to try to get a um, car mount for Live Miss. I might take you all riding around Lakeshore Drive, show you all a little Chicago. Can we go to the Olive Park? Everybody doesn't know about my obsession with <laughs> olive bars. For those of you that do know about her obsession of her olive bars, um, my son is in Chicago this week and had to send me a picture for Lou of an olive bar that he saw. You know what I want to show them, Karen? And you'll know what I'm talking about. The house in Logan Square. You know, <laughs> I can visit. You know what I'm talking about? The house in Christmas time. The guy in Logan Square who has that... Um, 
You know what I'm talking? Oh my God. What does he do? This house is intense. His whole, he has a, he has a corner house. Yes, on Logan Boulevard. Hi, Sandra. And Hi. he does his house from top to bottom in, in decorations and Christmas lights and everything. I do too. I try to go there every year too. And it's just amazing what he does. He has whole little vignettes. He has little all over, all over his yard, going up to the roof. He just has lights all over. You never see them in person? I go and I go and visit them almost every year. I used to go around one of the towns that's by us. They had um, there was a guy that had tons of stuff, and he even had like the cutout of the Grinch climbing on the roof and stuff like that. And See, he had a bunch of the stuff on them. Yes, it's right by Target. Yeah, yeah. He's it, I've seen it, and I was like, my friend took me there a few years ago. I was like, oh my god, this is insane! But it's really, really good. I'm so mad that I missed the full moon fire jam. Okay, so here she goes. Look. <laughs> What? She said she saw the Nessa Myers and wanted to throw something at her. <laughs> She's still talking about this full on hug. Ladessa is still claiming she's going to be on time. Okay, the park in Madison that Tammy's talking about, they have the um, electrical engineers put together a whole thing where they drive through the park and they have all different things lit up and you just drive through the entire park and see all the different things lit up. It's really cool. But they do before, I think it's like right before Thanksgiving and through the New Year and it's really a neat thing. Right, I always think that too. I always think it's really cute, but I also think what is their oh God, yeah. electric bill like? But I heard that he's a he was a doctor. Well, and I know some of them, I mean, not necessarily that one, but I know some of the ones that have the big ones, they'll take donations and stuff too. <clears throat> no, he doesn't do all that. It's doesn't. just his whole thing. And what I've heard is like he has people come right in to and help him. And comes and does the whole thing. Mm -hmm. You know, we staying away from Nessa Myricks at remember, we don't the Nessa Myricks gets no dollars from us because they bullshit us. And the Nessa Myricks is like kind of like with the makeup show. Because she travels with them all the time. Right. Sorry, I miss I don't know who that is. She was the one that we went. She's a, a makeup artist, but she has her own line. When we went last year, she's oh, the one okay, who, okay, who didn't okay, put her stuff on discount and acted like that. That people told us we were getting okay, discount. Yep, yep, yep. Fuck her ass. <laughs> I'm like, Honey, what is that? But I remember you talking about that. Yeah. Okay, so when we went there last year, patients, her stuff was. Um, okay, look at you. Who you? Look at you. Look at her. Ladessa is texting. <laughs> if anybody's wondering what's going on. <laughs> right. Yeah, remember, so we at you know, everybody was giving a discount. Mm -hmm. They were like, oh, we're doing 20%, and they did not give us no fucking discount. Which I mean that's kind of the point of the whole show is to give the pro deserve whoever a discount. Mm -hmm. Right. This is a pro this is a pro show. Yeah, it's not you, just for Everybody and their brother, so. Right. I mean, like, IMAX gives them. She has foundation. She does highlighters. I think, that's, I think she does something else now, but at the time, she was doing foundation and highlighters primarily. Concealer. It don't matter. She ain't getting another dab from me. <laughs> Fuck Danessa Myers. And I don't know who she is, but they'll for sure point it out to me, I'm sure. <laughs> don't you dare go over there. <laughs> I mean, she travels with the show. So, you would think, yeah. That's weird. Right, waterproof house. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever, I'm done with her. And her foundation was greasy. I know people like it. Yeah, I tried to shit on it. It was greasy. Did you see Bella's question? What's she say? Do you need anything to get the discount? Um, no. Once you're in, you get the discount. Um, no. Everybody usually get, you know, they have discount pricing. Everybody has discount pricing except for her. Everybody has discount pricing. 
but then there's you said like some of you can sign up for getting the pro discount afterwards right that you might right. have to show them something right um smashbox doesn't make you show anything really um but you smashbox you can usually get your pro discount there steal it because i think i have a steal it pro discount i don't know I th- i've never used I thought it you did i thought they finally set it up but i've never tried to use it so i don't know but i think i do yeah, um, there was some kind of weird thing with it i don't remember right um, but Smashbox definitely because I've used it. <laughs> yeah, Josh was second guess. Yeah. Cause it was so it was um Boo thing about to come in so we could talk about her in live on the oh, live. Oh. So where is she at? The crown? <laughs> Out in these streets. That's how I know she ain't gonna make it on time. No. We know. Yeah, because because it was like we we were like, oh, what's yeah. the discount tonight? And they were like, oh, twenty percent. And especially if and everybody's doing it, it would be different if it was like, okay, there's only certain things you got yeah. to afford or something. No, yeah, if everybody's. Doing I it, mean, like Smashbox right. had buy two, and they had a sale on. <laughs> oh, there she is. Okay, half for you out in the streets. You ain't gonna make it at nine a.m. You are not gonna make. It. I'm calling you though. Calling you from the car, taking me to work. Guess who coming with us, Ladessa? Guess who's gonna <laughs> meet us there? Yeah, L- Bella is coming to meet us. At- yes, she Bella has- is meeting. She bought she a has ticket. The ticket. She bought a ticket. Yes. She bought a ticket. Ooh, I'm at fifty percent. Oh, no. Okay, we got Bella. Bit- you've got the the sitters all locked down. And she everything. says she don't have the kids. Oh well, there you go. I'm like you better have that sitter all locked down, kids. And I'm calling you to wake you up. And I have no control over her, so. And Lisa's getting me drunk. Yeah. It didn't take much to get her drunk. <laughs> she's got. She bought the ticket. She says she's meeting us. Yes. She already has the ticket. So. Drop the ass <laughs> You better not get a call in the middle of the night to come get them either. No. I bet not hear that. Pretend that the phone just Do- never rang. <laughs> don't be a <laughs> not <laughs> ticket. <laughs> Hell, at this point, I don't even know where my tickets are. Yeah, getting you drunk. Yeah, I think we've already succeeded at that, haven't we, Joshua? No, we have not. No, if I if I'm drunk, I'd be leaned back in this chair, just like that. I don't understand how men sit like that. That's just a... <laughs> she's been obsessing about the men sitting like that since they put it together. <laughs> Cause you know when you ride in the car behind a man. I was attacked by today. Listen, okay, hold up, hold up. Let's just talk about this. If a bee attacked your head, you would have acted the same exact way I did. Exact same way I did. Don't even act like you would not. Although I was sitting right next to her and I didn't freak out. Because the bee didn't hit your head. <laughs> Honey, I will be up early. You know, I'm the, nothing keeps me from the crack of dawn. Yeah, she has to. Take I gotta take me to work anyway. <laughs> that would. She might have a headache tomorrow morning when she takes me to work, but we'll she'll be in my Starbucks. <laughs> Listen, the bee tried to take me out. The bee tried to take me out. It was right here on my head. Come on now. And I'm it usually. It was a near death experience. It was just. It was. No, let me tell you what happened. No, for real. We had a spider in the car for a while. This damn spider, I could not find it to kill it. And I was driving to work and that bitch got on the steering wheel and I almost had a crash. Because <laughs> I was like, oh shit. Okay. I'll tell you this one about uh, Drama Queen. Oh, you coming? You come, wait a minute. <clears throat> the dad said, so you coming? You getting your Starbucks with me? Because I'm getting some stress. Give me some Starbucks too. I better be with you. No shit. So, uh, drama queen. We were coming back from one of her softball games, and she's deathly afraid of bugs. Flying roaches. Any type of bugs. Any. That 
fuck me up. A flying roach would just fuck up. A me moth, up. a butterfly, an ant. It doesn't matter. She freaks out. Driving down the road, all of a sudden, she starts screaming. There's a moth! There's a moth! There's a moth! You need to stop. You need to stop. Have you need to stop right now. Have a good time, Ladessa. We'll That's see you about 10 ish. So she's screaming, screaming. You need to pull the book. Pull it over so that we can kill the book. So my husband finally just pulls over because we're just not going to get down the road unless we pull over to kill this bug. It's a no, sunflower. No, we do not have flying roaches in Chicago. Hell no. no. It was a sunflower seed shell that my <laughs> husband had spit out the window and flew in the back window and hit her. <laughs> but we had to stop because there was a bug. And then we finally found it that it was... But I like that one. I like that yeah. one. Screaming her head off, and we stopped. And we're like, it was a sunflower seed. No, we do not. No, have it was fly. not. It was not. We do not have flying. Cause Dessa's on a date, honey. Dessa just mm -hmm. came in, said a little something to her. She out in the, she out in these streets, unlike me. And oh, let me tell you, flying roaches would fuck me up. Although I'm pretty sure that the last makeup show, this is kind of how you were by the time uh, you were on with Ladessa and driving around in the car. Oh, that's right. We did do a live in her car. And you yeah. were not feeling the best at that point in time. Well, actually, I should say you were feeling very happy at that point in time. You... Thank you, Melissa. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. The last makeup show we went on. Me and Ladessa went on a Saturday. Oh, she went on a drag show and all kinds. Yeah, of yeah. Ladessa had me out all day long. I went up at a drag show. I, I didn't make it home till about three o'clock in the morning. Yeah, That's what I think like. that live got taken down pretty quickly. After yeah, that. yeah. Yeah. I'm like, what? They're live? What? Yeah, we was in the car. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, the guys was hitting on. Yeah, we had a lot going. Oh, that's right, the guy was hitting yes. on me on the streets. Yes, yes, yes at the yes. bar. Yes, the guy at the bar. Yeah, we. It was. Yeah, long I think day. by the next day, I was looking to see if it was still up, and I'm like, oh, it's not up there anymore. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh my goodness, no. Okay, so. Yeah, yeah, he did think I was cute. <laughs> I was a little fetching that day. I was a fetching. Okay, as long as I'm not sweating, as long as I'm not swollen tomorrow, I'll be cute too. See, I'm gonna have to get off here because this is my feet are starting to swell. Not as bad as they have been though, so that's a good thing. But I'm gonna elevate them before I go to sleep. So and eat me a little more piece of meat before I go to bed. Gotta get that iron in. Gotta get that beef in. Okay. And it was very good too. I got to have some for dinner. Oh, okay. So you did like it. Yay! Because my spicy beef is good. Yeah, Lulu can cook. So. Well, okay. We've been on here longer than I'm supposed to. You know, I cut it off at two hours. We, um, so I gotta get out of here. Tipsy, she talked a little longer. So, so it's time to go. And the, and the bee fucked fucked up my whole existence for a minute. So you know, she's scared it though. It hasn't been back. <laughs> she terrified the poor. I probably did. <laughs> Damn, be more scared than me. Oh, okay. Let me say this. Y'all making me know that I ain't never gonna live in Texas because if they got some flying ass cockroaches, I do not need to be there. And they have snakes. I know. Mm -hmm. Really, nope. Melissa? You got a gift to work on? Really? Okay, okay. I got you. I got you. Send it to Send me. Send it to me, too, because I would love to see this. Oh, and you're making one, too, Ash? Oh, I thought y'all love. Okay, I see. I, I better gotta, see that later, Ash. I see that, I, I see what y'all think of me. I see what y'all think of me. I keep telling her she'd flip over in the chair, she'd go viral, and she'd have tons of stuff. She'd go viral on. However, I know Ashley ain't playing. Facebook and Twitter. I know Ashley ain't playing. I know I you're serious. serious. <laughs> we know you, Ashley. We know you're serious. I know you serious. All right, y'all. I, I gotta get out of here. This is gonna be good. <laughs> she gonna put it in the damn group. I know she is. I know you. Okay. 
See y'all later. Thank y'all for hanging out with us. Bye, everyone. It was nice to see everybody for once, and you got to see my face. <laughs> <laughs> you say you're, no, you know what? Listen, I'm that. Oh, it would have been on magical, my Ashley. It would have been magical. <laughs> see ya, see ya. Okay, we got to keep our face together.